Okay, hello everyone and welcome into my live Rise of Kingdoms live stream. And today, as the title says, we're going to be spectating Kingdom, well, KVK number 12151 will soon, as soon as I <laughs> make a couple of stuff in here. Which is, first of all, I need to post my Discord server and. Oh, yeah, what did I just do? First of all, I need to post my Discord server, and after that... Okay, let's go like this, let's go like boom, pin message, and we are good to go, this is done, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's see what else do we have to do right now, just before we get to the good part, to the good stuff. Okay, so everything should be fine. Let's just send maybe some gem gathering expeditions. Okay, let's just find like a, a couple of gems here and there for us to gather, and we're gonna get back into watching the KVA, okay, just like I said. Just like I said, just give me like a quick moment though. Ooh, I'm way too far with that. I don't even know why I went for it, but okay. God damn, that's hella far away. <laughs> to, just to collect a couple of gems, but never mind. Okay, now uh, this one is being collected. Let's see, we need one more spot. One more spot and then we can actually go and watch the KV game. One more spot, come on. Be good to me game, be good to me. There we go, we found it. Only 10 gems, but hey, it's not free. It's not free. You don't you don't find these things like that easily. <laughs> hey Kerimo, welcome to the live stream, my brother. Hello, hello, hello to you. Now getting back into the 2910 KVK. I believe we're done with everything we need to do in here. Of course we need to do the champions of Olympia, but we're not gonna do that right now. We're gonna do it just a little bit later. To make sure that we are gonna spectate. Like, like I said, like I said from yesterday that today we would find some time to watch the Green Dudes KVK. Now I really wish that he would be here. So let me just like Discord the guy. Let me just Discord Green Dude. Let me just Discord the guy because I want him to give me some really good information about his KVK and everything that's going on. You know. Okay, so everyone knows that we're live now, and let's get back into watching. Well, first of all, I have no idea who the allies are, so that's why I, I would really want Bindu to be around here. Like, if he actually was here, he could give us like such some really <coughs> nice information related to this KVK and guide us through. Like, if anything, I would have loved if he would even be welcome, or if he would like to join on Discord voice. Maybe through his cell phone or something. I feel like uh, Green Dude should really give us a little bit of information about his KVK. From what are we seeing though? This is like completely peaceful though. Is there any fighting going on in here or what? What exactly is going on in here? I've, I'm seeing zero fighting. Never mind. We see some burn flags here and there. Where's the big fight though? Like, what, what exactly is going on right now? And hello, green dude. What up? Welcome, man. Welcome. Like I said, like I promised, we are gonna be watching your KVK today. If there's anything interesting going on, if not, then we will just go back to 145. But I really wanna. I I, I just spent like uh, 15 minutes trying to make like a banner and uh, a thumbnail about it. So I would really like to watch yours <laughs> instead. <laughs> Lila, hey, 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 brother, welcome, welcome. Transfer ownership to someone. Oh, the leader of your alliance transfer ownership to someone. Oh, goddamn. 
Today the alliance was at war, something weird? Oh man, yeah, this is this thing kind of tends to happen sometimes when the kingdom is new. Like usually people will just give up their king position for money or stuff like that and then we just like give up the account. Like here you go brother, this is your account now and you're king so it's up to you now what you want to do with it. And normally they, they get a huge chunk of money for handing over an account which is actually a leader of the of kingdom. Well, allies are blue and purple, enemies are red and cyan, so blue and purple are allies. Red and cyan enemies. I'm not really seeing that, that many huge wars are going on right now. Looks like Green Dude's allies lost one of their passes. Oh, which one would that be? Wait a minute. I see one, two... Oh, blue and purple. One, two, three, and four. Seems like they're fighting here, right? Oh, goddamn, man. Damn, brother. But I see that they're like gaining territory back, though. Like, yes, they lost one of their passes, but it appears as if they're gaining back territory because I see them burning the enemy down. Is Blue's top pass being attacked? Good question, let's go and see. So we got... Yeah, oh yeah, there's the fight, there's the fight. This is where they're fighting. We see ATVS, ATVS should be these guys, right? No, it actually isn't, it's actually these guys. Who's ATVS? Oh yeah, they're definitely, definitely like... This is, by the way, this is Green Dude's kingdom. Well, probably it's always happening at the, at the wrong time. <laughs> it's okay, man. We promise that we'll watch our KVK. I'm really sorry that I could not cover it before because I really, really couldn't do. Oh, you're just uh, you're getting rallied. Like your pass is getting rallied. Why is it not getting defended? Did you did you guys like give up on the on the pass or something? Like what what exactly are you trying to do with it? Like what what is the plan? What 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 are you guys trying to do with it? Also, you know, if you want to join my Discord by voice, I would be more than welcome to to, uh, to welcome you, man. You could maybe like briefly explain to us what exactly is going on and the situation and everything that just happened, like the whole story of the KVK. Like, I would be more than welcome to, to welcome the story into my into my live stream. But goddamn, it appears that uh, your kingdom is in a really bad spot, man. Yeah. Yeah, it appears that you are just gonna lose this pass, unfortunately, and I'm not seeing you guys gathering up for a fight. If anything, I, f I feel like uh, this KVK is already over. Because I'm not really seeing any troops. So I'm seeing both Red and CN trying to close you guys down to the gates. And this is really scary. Yeah, no, 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 no need to say sorry, man. Like, literally, like, I, I can see what's going on. Like, it's not like you're the kingdom, you're just a guy. Like, you're just one of the people, so if the whole kingdom doesn't want to fight, then it's by no means your, your, uh, your fault. In summary, the R5 of my alliance was for leadership to someone, and then they turned it into a farm alliance, and then for, for some reason the farm alliance was at war. You should really get yourself into the first rank alliance, man. Well, maybe not. I don't know if it's possible for you to get into the first rank alliance, but try your best to get in, at least in the top three or top five. Like, do your best to go to the highest alliance possible. Like, stop worrying about the idea of, uh, well, it's my friends and stuff like that. You will make new friends, man. Just, just go to where you should, basically. Oh, man. Yeah, this pass is for sure gone. Like I see zero troops defending it. Like down bottom, I could, I am definitely seeing your allies fight. But as as, as far as you guys go, uh, I'm really not seeing 2910 uh, care too much about protecting this. The purple coalition is still fighting back. Yeah, yeah, yeah I noticed that. Oh man, the moment that they take this, though, it's going to be super scary for you. I 
I'm almost not seeing zero fighting going on anywhere, so it feels like you guys just gave up on this KVK already. Yeah, this territory is already gone. Let, let's just go and see what the CN is doing. Wow, god damn, I was really expecting a good fight though, like, because this KVK started only 24 hours ago, so it, it, it seems way too soon for, for everyone to give up this easily, but, uh... Yeah, your allies are fighting just a little bit. I'm not saying that they have like those huge numbers, uh, but at least they're fighting a little bit. They're trying their best, you know, they're trying their best to to push everywhere that is possible. It appears that as if they, they gain like just a little bit of ground. Eighteen, eighteen. I also losing the KVK we watched yesterday. Oh, really? Are they? I I didn't check. Like after yesterday, I really didn't check anymore what what was going on. But I guess in the end of the day, I was right. Seventy five DC is the the big guys still. Like those guys just haven't fallen from grace just yet. Like there was a time when seventy five DC was one of the best alliances and uh, one of the best kingdoms ever. So. I really wouldn't expect anything less from them, even though, I'm not gonna lie, yesterday 1818 was really putting in the work, so I was thinking maybe, just maybe, like just, just very barely maybe, 1818 could have a shot. I don't know how good or bad the situation is on the 2910 Kingdom, all I'm seeing is that they're like super AFK right now. Like they're really not doing anything anymore. These guys are definitely fighting though, like look at them, look at CN man, CN is not giving up on this. I don't know how they got pushed back this much but... I don't know how they got pushed back this much, but these guys appear to be fighters, man. Like, they, they just aren't giving up just yet on this KVK. It seems like CN downtime. Yes, it does, and they're taking full advantage of that. But Blue is really gonna struggle. Blue is really struggling right now, and I'm not even seeing them trying to put like maybe some uh, some fights going on I don't know if this is maybe like downtime of the CN maybe it's like this guy's downtime I'm waiting for green dude to let me know what's going on right now CN King is bubbled what the hell oh where did you even see that where was the CN King Wait a minute. This is the king? Ah, oh, Lions members. DVX, yeah, this is the king. No, this is not the king. Wait a minute. Where did you even see the king being bubbled, brother? I think that half of the members are resting. But what about the other half? Why aren't the, like, the other half trying to do something about it? <laughs> Like, this feels like a good moment, like you guys should keep your, your enemies like occupied or something. At the very least you should just try to maybe keep your uh, your enemies occupied. So that it may, maybe make it like just a little bit harder for, you, for them to push. I see that some of the guys, like, I see that some people are trying to like fight just a little bit. but. Like we're seeing some win guys, like trying to trade some small stuff, but at the end of the day... At the end of the day, uh, it appears that this guy just lost the will to fight though. 
Like, it just appears as if these guys lost the will to fight. And I'm seeing some really powerful guys in here, so I, I don't feel like you gave it your all. I don't feel like that, that was all that you had to, to, to give in this KVK. See, like, Win is trying to fight some small stuff, but they just appear, uh, appear to be, like, super scared of the enemy. Like, if there was maybe, like, a location where you, where you guys were fighting, I would understand, but I'm not seeing you guys fight anywhere. I guess in, in purple we trust, if, if you want to win this KVK man, <laughs> in purple we trust. I, purple is, is trying to push a little bit, here and there. There shouldn't be resting in Kingsland. I mean, I can't speak today. Yeah, that's basically what I'm, what I'm saying. Like, this is only 25, uh, 12. It's only like less than 24 hours within the Kingsland. So, it doesn't really make that much sense for the, for the kingdom or for the coalition to give up this easily. Even, even 3207 didn't give up this easily. Like, we were fighting the second day. Like, yeah, we were getting pushed back. Yeah, we, we were playing behind the the gate but uh, we were fighting back a little bit so this is this is kind of worse than 3207 I ain't gonna lie I got them Elias Bo hello brother welcome to the stream today man What's up? Not much, man. I wanted to spectate Green Dude's KVK, but uh, it just doesn't appear to be. <coughs> it just doesn't appear to be going that well, man. If anything, it, it appears as if these guys are really badly losing the KVK right now. Like they they getting pushed back at the gate. Savage, we seeing Savage guy trying to fight a little bit here but he losing ground of course he's fighting a guy who's like 30 million power bigger than him why would you be shielded in this position though like maybe because it's downtime I guess that he probably anticipated the fact that uh, he might be getting pushed back and maybe he would kind of like Loki wants to protect himself but Huh. So you did have some fighting going on, man. Nice, nice. So you did have some fighting going on. Some nice kill points. Not bad. Really not have bad, man. Ah, it appears that you're not you're not here anymore. So basically they, they got this position back from you. Because I'm seeing red now. My city got teleported automatically after my flag got removed. Weird? Yes, it is. I didn't know that your city would get teleported uh, automatically out of the if the flag gets removed. Like, if anything, when the flag gets removed, that's when you burn the guy. So, this is really weird. This guy is gonna rally something. I don't know what he's gonna rally, but this guy's gonna rally something. Oh, we see some, we see some, uh, we see some hope. We see some guys moving. <laughs> we see something. We see some wind guys trying to do something. I don't know what they're trying to do, but we see them trying to do something. But oh, wow, though, like uh, I didn't expect the difference to be this big. Kingdom 1996, by the way, if 
he's if he's afk that's crazy the one with the king title should never be afk in war that is true that is true they should always have at least three kings in order to uh, uh, basically switch between them I don't know man, but all I can say is that this is really weird, really sad, the fact that this KVK is already over within 24 hours. Like yes, purple is burning a few flags here and there because it's the enemy AFK time, but I, the fact that they got pushed back this much uh, can only mean one thing, that uh, the CN basically de demolished them. Are, is the CN pushing here as well or like are they like trying to push in here too? Yes, they are So CN is putting in some work Even though I feel like once this flag is gonna fall 100% the red guys are gonna take over By the way CV 96 Aren't these like the same guys as uh, 30, uh, 3196 CV like it, it, it appears to be like the same Alliance. Have you checked your uh, Zerus League opponents for tomorrow? No, I haven't. Now that I you, you make me think about it, I really haven't. Match information. Oh man, we really aren't in a good spot though. Oh yeah, like this. This is gonna suck. Like they really have more power than we do. They really have a lot more power than we do. But uh, maybe power is not everything. So maybe maybe we still stand a chance. Uh, I will not be streaming, unfortunately, my Zara's League because I will not be at home when that happens. I will be taking part in it, but I will not be streaming it. I ain't gonna lie, it does suck. Like the, the fact that. Uh, Oh, there we are. There we are. We see some clashing going on between purple and red. There we go. There already is some clashing going on in here. Let's see who can gain the advantage. Yeah, the people that are resting in the Kingsland are probably going to get zeroed. But if you know that you're going to sleep, man, why would you even stay there? Like, I always make sure to teleport out if I'm gonna sleep. I always make sure to teleport out, like, at least a good distance like this. And I check, like, myself up every three hours. Or if I'm not sure if I can check myself in three hours, I literally go to the very edge of the... of my alliance. Gonna be a fun match? At least no farming? Yeah. I, I just hope that we win it though. I really hope that we win it because at the end of the day the rewards from Azarus League are really good to, to be losing on them. Ah, oh, he's just doing barbs. So Phoenix just beat the the TD guy, like they're all running back. So maybe the purple does have a shot at winning this still. Plus if you look at them... They only lost part of their territory, which is this one, so maybe they were AFK, it was like their downtown, and they that's why they were pushed. But maybe they got a shot to get back at this, who knows. I guess we, we will have to see. This dude is green. <laughs> oh yeah, it just, uh, I ain't gonna lie, it does feel bad, the fact that uh, Green Dude's coalition is losing this badly. Even because they appear to have like a really good start of the uh, of the kingdom, of the KVK, from what he was telling me, so I was really expecting them to do a lot better. But at the end of the day, man, doesn't really matter. Like at the end of the day, what matters is that uh, with every passing KVK, you get stronger, you get better, and you're always, uh, yeah, like you're always more ready to do what you must do. The stronger you get, the better it is. So you gotta look at this maybe like on a personal progress. 
besides like the KVK only. It doesn't matter if the kingdom is bad, at the end of the day you're still getting better. So I guess the, the biggest goal that you have into this game is to make yourself better and if the kingdom is not good enough you will just go to a better kingdom. Which is probably gonna welcome you if you are good enough. Okay, let, let's uh, let's get down here. Like they're literally burning CN all over. They are burning CN all over, and we, we're gonna be watching this for at least like three hours. So we will see how this goes. We will see how this goes. I'm hoping that they can burn the enemy just enough to to gain some control of this uh, position. Like at least have the kingdom. If they if they can get at least have the kingdom before the enemy turns online, I feel like th they would uh, stall the enemy quite a bit. Why don't they have at least 50 people who protect flags in downtown? Yeah, my question exactly. Like one of the best trades that uh, 1960 had into the KVK is the fact that they were 24-7 online. Like they always, of course they had like downtime and everything, but they didn't have like uh, they didn't have like all the people offline when, when it was like their downtown. They always had some people fighting. So being able to have like a 24-7 KVK, online KVK is a good thing. Feel like they should try and rally this thing like you have zero enemies in here so why not try and rally it even if you're gonna cancel the the very least that you can do is you can try to rally this thing and if you do try to rally it you, you're gonna attract some enemies here and you're gonna make it easier for your allies so you at least want to provide pressure even if you're not gonna if you even if you do not have the strength to to make the big fights at least provide some pressure Gather the numbers, don't fight, it's okay, but at least make the enemy stay here. So if the enemy stays here, you're gonna allow your allies to, which is the purple guys, to push a little bit better because some of the enemy forces are gonna be... are gonna be focused on you, so... I, and to be honest, I'm seeing purple do some stuff, like I'm seeing the CN being completely AFK right now, completely offline. I think I know what to expect now, you should have an equal amount of people in time zones, else you would have a situation like this, not trying to shame anyone. But how did the start of the KVK go, like, uh, did the start of the KVK go well for you, like, uh, were you able to push just a little bit against the, like, does your kingdom appear to be maybe like giving up or is it just like downtime and you expect yourself to fight tomorrow as well? So this is basically what, what I'm trying to, the information that I'm trying to gather here. Did you guys give up or are you just downtime and whenever you come online you're gonna be fighting a lot more still? Like do you still have power to fight? I'm gonna hack the leader of rank 1 alliance and give myself PR5. <laughs> I wanna see that too. I'll, I'll send them a definitely not says <laughs> email with an attachment. Well, we do have active hours, but right now we are having a downtime sadly. Okay, so at least in active hours, you, you guys are fighting though. Like, it's not like your kingdom gave up. It's not like you guys just uh, sent the email, which is uh, we lost KVK, GG, well played, and uh, let's go next KVK. As long as that didn't happen, then uh, it's okay, I guess. As long as that didn't happen, everything is alright. By the way, is the music fine or is the music too loud or is the music too low? Anyone can give me like a reply on that, please? Oh, 
Oh, this guy's gonna eat it though. Like, if this flag burns, this guy is really gonna be in huge trouble if he's AFK. Like, I don't know when he's expected to come online, but this flag will burn in maybe like one hour. Yo, Lilauch, by the way, do you happen to know if uh, the CV from uh, 1196 is the same as the CV from 3196? Because it appears to be the same alliance, like CV96, so... It's making me guess that these guys are the same guys that we fought back whenever we were in 3207. So basically we have purple trying to burn the whole CN right now, down, which is in their downtime. But red doesn't appear to be in their downtime, if anything they appear to be very much active. They just aren't pushing up here anymore, right now. So I don't know where they're trying to focus or... They're definitely not focusing here. Trying to see what exactly they would want to focus themselves on. Maybe like some here, maybe? Nah, no, not really. I'm gonna have to live and give myself uh, 10 million T5 troops with 6 septillion gems. You know, even then, man, even then, the pay to win guys would still kill you. This is the funny thing about Rise of Kingdoms. Even with hacking, you're not you're not as good enough as, as the people who, who play money. Who are pouring money into the game, I'm sorry. Umid, hello, man, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello to you. Thirty-two or seven kingdom Argus. Oh, I remember you, man. I remember you. Hello, Argus. How's thirty-two or seven doing, man? How you guys holding up for the next KVK? I really want to know what thirty-two or seven is up to right now. What are the allies and what are the enemies? Uh, basically, it's blue and purple, like these two against these two. So it's kind of like left versus right type of fight right now. Alright bro, I'm doing good man, I'm doing good, like, we finally... Oh, there you are. There they are. I'm definitely doing good, like, we, I finally got uh, an off day, meaning that I'm not working. Well, I was working today, but tomorrow I'm not working on Sunday, so I'm taking my time to, make, to maybe make, like, a really good live stream. And I promised Green Dude that I would uh, see what their kingdom was up to, and they're in the KVK right now, so this is where Green Dude, one of my best viewers my most loyal viewers is at and they are trying to fight for the king's land right now they are really losing though <laughs> they're really losing but i promise that i would be seeing their kvk and uh, that that's what i'm doing that's what i'm gonna be doing for the next two hours or something and how are you man how's everything going in 3207 Wait a minute, are they switching alliances? They're switching alliances. They're switching alliances down here, okay. So they appear to be switching alliances right now. L uh, CLD is just trying to take over right now. Who are these guys? They're just a farm alliance though. So I, I'm not understanding, I'm really not understanding why they're switching over. Maybe it's like temporarily or something, but maybe trying to like, tra yeah, I guess they're trying to like transport some resources. 
to the main cities and they're trying to build in here but why would they go with such a weak alliance? Brother, I want you to share the 3207 KVK War 2 right now pre-KVK. Uh, I have zero information on that though. I could do it, but I need someone to give you information on it. Because right now I know nothing about 3207 and their pre-KVK. Like I need screenshots, I need information. Like if you can give me that, I can 100% sure do, do a video about it. Like don't, uh, I'm, I'm more than welcome, I'm more than happy to share the 3207 KVK. Make, make like a separate video on it. Like I cannot do it this, this live stream. Because this one is for 2910, but if you can send me some really good screenshots about information and as to what what is going on, the enemies, the allies, uh, the basically everything, man, the rankings, who are your main biggest enemies, who are you expected to fight, how are you gonna position, you know, like all of that stuff. Give me information, man, and I can definitely make a video about it. Like just because I left 3207 doesn't mean that I, I'm not uh, supporting you guys anymore. Don't get don't get that wrong. Like, send me information and I can definitely cover your KVK. 100 percent. 100 percent, brother. You you just gotta let me know though. So whoever from 3207 wants to send me information, you can just come into my Discord, which is you can message me in here as well in the game too. But Discord is kind of like more official even though truth be told no, no no just just send them to me in into the game like maybe some screenshots of the rankings and everything else and i can definitely cover it like 100 percent just a few more years and i'll have city hall 598 <laughs> i cannot wait for you to get city hall 598 man Okay, see, I don't know what exactly the purple is planning right now. It's kind of weird that they're actually going with uh, with this weak uh, alliance right now. Because they're missing time. Like, okay, I guess as soon as they build these two flags, they, they're just going to switch again. And uh, But they're, they're wasting time. Like, right now they should burn CN as much as they can. And they maybe they could have switched maybe later. But now it's they, they really shouldn't switch now, man. Like they switch way too quickly like you gotta take advantage of the fact that the enemy is afk and you should be trying your best to burn them down now uh, that you actually can do that so it appears as if red is trying to burn all the way down here so they're trying to close both gates like this is what they're trying to do right now Why are you fighting with only one march though? Why not trade with the second march? Like you got the advantage, you, you should take advantage of that. Okay, just like a single moment because I need to farm a, a bit of gems though. I need to farm some gems so just give me like a quick second to need to find some gem spots into my... Come on, find me some gems, please. Because I know that we're watching the KVK, but at the same time, we gotta put in the work to our own <laughs> city. Like, we really cannot stop. Like, my KVK is gonna start as well in maybe like a month or something, so I really gotta be ready for it. The more gems that I have, the better it is. Like, you never should stop collecting gems if you can. There we go, that's one. Okay, that's two. This should be three. Come on, can I be just a little bit lucky though? Can I be just a little bit lucky? Okay, nice, I am, I am, I am. 
Anyway Argus, just like I said man, you sent me information about the 3207 KVK and pre-KVK and I can definitely cover you up. I got you, I got you buddy. I just gotta, I just gotta know what's going on so I can share it though. I can definitely make a video about the 3207. I don't mind, like at the end of the day I'm trying to support the whole community, the whole game. It's not like just because I'm in 3152 right now that I'm only covering these guys. That's not what's going on right now. For sure. Fears! Hello, man! Maybe this time 07 to 100 million decides to fight too? <laughs> I hope. So. Oh, no, the, the 200 million guy is actually in 328 right now, Ilias. She is with Connor, like Seraphine was her name and she was about 200 million power and she is in in 3208, she actually migrated. Avor 3207 is in our camp? Then that's even better man, like I, I need to know some information about your KVK and I can definitely cover you guys up. I, I, can, I can definitely do that. Because I, I had like uh, Argus here trying to tell me that he wanted me to cover some stuff up ab about uh, your pre-KVK and I was like I can definitely do that it's just that I have zero information about what is going on there and that's like the only reason as to why I'm not doing it. But if you can post me, if you can keep me posted on the KVK I can definitely cover you guys up and when, when the Kingsland starts or something like when do I get a mod when you take me on the goddamn vacation brother. That's when you get mod. You want mod? You gotta earn it. When we go to Amsterdam to get together. <laughs> That's when you get mod. You gotta earn your, your spot in here. <laughs> Add me on Discord. Fears. I'll, I'll, I'll send some stuff to you. Nice. Well, if you can send them to me, I can definitely add you on 100% uh, on uh, on Discord. Just let me let me just send you a uh, message you on Discord right now. But that being said, if you can send me the screenshots in 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 the game, it would be a lot better because it would be easier for me. You can even send them to me by maybe like some an anonymous farm or stuff like that. If you if you don't exactly want you to be covered as the guy who's sending me the information, I don't know, for, for various reasons. So let me just see, first of all I need to make... Add friends, so your name is Dot Fears. No, but uh, what I actually want to do is I want to make a new friends, add a friend, dot fears, send a friend request. Okay, friend request send, brother. Friend request send. I mean, I don't know. I, I really hope that you're just in downtime and you will fight later, man. Because otherwise this thing kind of low-key sucks for, for your kingdom green dude. This guy's gonna burn though, like once these two flags go away... There's no other flag protecting you. Oh man, you... We're just gonna see this guy burn alive. Like 100% if this guy doesn't tell, get the hell out of the way in like 5 minutes, this guy's gonna get burned the hell out. <clears throat> Send him a ticket to Amsterdam. Yeah, exactly. 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 You should... This guy wants mod. Like, Fears wants mod into my live stream. I'm like, you can get it, but I gotta earn me something too, right? Don't you feel like it's fair, though? Oh man, this guy is 100% gonna burn. If he doesn't teleport out right now, he is 100% dead.
Let's see. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if he's going to teleport out or he's actually AFK. Okay, this is the moment of the truth. This is the moment of the truth. Bam, gone. Once this flag goes right here. Yeah, they're preparing for it. They're actually getting ready. This is gonna be... Oh man, yeah, this guy's toasted. This guy is toasted. If he doesn't get the hell out of there, he's toasted. Look at them teleporting. Look at the wolves. Look at the wolves, man. They're they waiting for it. They, they were waiting for this stuff right now. This guy's gonna get burned the hell out. This guy is gonna get burned the hell out. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Yeah, look at him. Brother, you better be online and playing. You better be online and playing. Otherwise, you're gone for. I hope. I hope. <laughs> I hope for you, man. I hope that you're online. Otherwise, you're gonna get burned. You're gonna wake up in the morning, man, and have a really bad day. So, I really hope that you're online right now. Look at them coming through. Look at them. All of them just coming through for, for, the, for the raid, man. I don't know if he's gonna get rallied or literally just uh, just just get zeroed. Oh, this is this is huge. They're getting ready. They're getting ready. They are getting ready. Zeroing time 100%. If this guy is online, he should get the hell out of here right now. He should not be playing anymore. Send me some stuff on Discord, yeah man, uh, I'm, I'm gonna check you out in a moment. He's pretty much zeroed, I cannot tell, but the fact that he's getting like, yeah, yes. no, come on, I was really hoping to, <laughs> uh, I was really hoping to see someone getting swarmed, but uh, I guess he was ready for it. Will he be imprisoned? Nah, no, it's too late now. They should have done that. If, if they had done it, 100%, but uh, he shielded. Yeah, he shielded. God damn, he got me on the edge though. Like, he really played it good right there. He got me on the edge. For a moment, I thought that he was gonna get zeroed the hell out. He got me. <laughs> I was really, really preparing for it. Also, I don't know why they're, they're trying so hard to get this uh, this alliance here. Maybe it's like a farm alliance and they want to have some cities in the Kingsland to to do like faster uh, resource uh, help. But... Okay. No point in imprisoning when he doesn't have war friends. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Now, now, that, now that I'm thinking about it, that is more than true. So, Fears actually sent me the information that I need. KVK is Earth plus water versus fire plus wind. 3195 will get RCF, okay. 3221, 3207. Water is 3206, 32, 3222, 3219. 3196 is fire. 3201. Oh, you, now you play against 3201. Now you play against... Oh, I really wanted to, to fight 3201 before I left 3207, man. Like, I really wanted to fight those guys one last time. And now is when you actually get to fight them. This is super sad for me. Like, if anyone remembers, whenever I was in 3207 and we were kind of like in matchmaking, I said that I want to fight 3201. I said that I want to fight 3201, man. Diagonal KVK. Okay, nice. Uh, Fears, can you maybe like send me a few screenshots of uh, the pre-KVK rankings? 
maybe some updates, stuff like that, it would be nice. Like basically all the information that you're sending me right now, I can use it for a video later. So the more you send me, the, the easier it's gonna be for me to make like content about you guys. Both 3195 and 3207. Since both of you reached out to me, it's only fair that uh, I I try my best to make some content about both of you. Let's impress him for stealing content. <laughs> True. Aren't they like putting a flag in here to maybe like push faster or? Uh, are they not trying to push or are they just done with it? Are they gonna push somewhere else? In my opinion they should push here because this is where the Kingsland is. Oh yeah, so they're just basically trying to send themselves a couple of resources. Ninety five has told people not to push pre KVK and use everything. Okay. Do you by the way, never mind, I shouldn't read everything that you typed to me. My bad man. Never mind, my bad. I really shouldn't uh read out loud everything that you sent to me. But I will definitely work out with you and see what stuff we can share and what stuff we cannot share and uh make make some really good content about you guys. Also, I'll do my best to cover the important fights. Like, whenever an important gate opens in 3207 or 3195, basically, you guys let me know. Like, I can do my best to cover it. If, if I can, 100% I will do it. I'll even make, like, a special playlist about you guys. If, if, I, if I can make, like, more than one or two videos, I can make, like, a special playlist for you. And uh, whatever KVK that you will do, I will uh, keep you guys posted. How's 3207 and 95 looking for the next AVK though? Like, do you feel like you'll be ready about it? I haven't checked what 3207 or 3195 is doing anymore. But I hope that you guys are ready. I hope that this KVK goes nice for you because I'm not gonna lie, it sucked for both kingdoms. <laughs> the last KVK was really terrible for 3207 because they weren't active enough and for 3195 for the king getting hacked. So. I really wish that you guys have a better KVK than the last time. Thirty-one ninety-five has the highest kingdom power in this KVK. Really now? Okay, we will be leaving here just a moment because I want to see both thirty-one ninety-five and thirty-one thirty-two oh seven right now. I really want to see both of these kingdoms. See what you guys are up to. I want to see what you guys are up to. Just for like a split second, though. So, is this like the main alliance now? Is it OS? The main alliance or this guy is not the main alliance? Look at 3282. Uh, yeah, we can, we can check the thing out in a moment, in a second. This is Fierce. This is the guy who won't take me on vacations. By the way, for anyone who knows, this is the guy who won't take me on vacations right now. <laughs> ok, 
Okay, so what? Who is like the biggest guy that you have on your kingdom right now? Is it you? Like so far, you are the biggest guy that I'm seeing on your kingdom, power-wise, of course. Yeah, this is like the same. Oh, my. Actually, no, this is not the same. Oh, this is SS. Let, let's check these guys out as well, but it appears like they're like the secondary alliance. Oh, S and S. Okay, so is it me or are you like the biggest guy into the kingdom right now, Fierce? I think I'm 4th to 5th. Who's like the first guy? Can you maybe like send me some information about it? Like, whoa, who's the biggest guy that you have in here? I really can't find someone who's higher power than you. Like you're 87 million. Uh, this guy's 86. And he was close by, but he wasn't first one. So... Who exactly is the biggest guy that you have right now? Like, either these guys are not into the main alliance, or I really cannot pinpoint them. Oh, you have Potato. Never mind, he's 95 mil. I found one. So, Potato is like 95 mil. So far, he is the biggest guy that we've seen. The second one is Fears at 87 million, and I'm seeing no one else who is anywhere close. Check your Discord. Okay. Okay, so you have Miyuki and you have Potato. Oh, never mind. I really cannot see Miyuki though. Where was he? Where is, where is the guy hiding? Where is this guy hiding though? Was, he is in 95 OS according to the screenshot that you just sent me. So there should be a guy in here who's like 100 mil. You miss Yuki three times? Where is he? Oh, there he- never mind, found it, found it, found it, found it. Okay, 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 I know. Sometimes I have a really bad eyesight. <laughs> I have a really bad eyesight. <clears throat> Let's go in 3207. Let's go check 3207 next. Because I said that I would check 3207 next, and then we can check 3208, and we can definitely check 3202 as well, man. 100% Hong Kong, we can definitely check the 202 as well. There's the cigarette. There's the main alliance. There's Ares. There's Argus, by the way. <laughs> Neri. Okay, so some of these guys I know. This guy, H. HGK. I'm not really. I don't remember him that much. Ooh, they're definitely a lot more powerful than they were the last time. Let's check the secondary alliance though. <clears throat> Excuse me. So 7 and 4 bill. Let's go with 3208. Next. Okay, let's go with 3208. Uh, we're gonna cover everything but Connor in here. Huh? Itachi? Wait a minute. What? What is Itachi doing in 3208? I thought that he was in 3202. What the hell? I guess it's it's someone else, but or is it like him? Is it is it really him? Is it like maybe an account of his? It doesn't appear to be that. The 3208 though really has some nice guys. You have Kuzai, 140 mil by the way. Which is also on my stream of course. We got Zagi and where is Seraphine? I thought that Seraphine came in 3208, so she should be somewhere in here, right? Seraphine is 
Seraphim should be here. That's a different Tachi, yeah. Oh yeah, that's that's Seraphim too. Yeah, because it wasn't really making sense to me. Why would Itachi be like two kingdoms at the same time right now? Even more in two kingdoms who sometimes might even fight each other. 3208 are some really big guys though. Like I'm I don't even understand how you're in the same KVK. That's weird. Like you have two seven billion alliances, man. You have two seven billion alliances. How the hell are you into the same kingdom as three, uh, into the same KVK as 3207 and 3195? That's weird. <laughs> That's super weird. Seraphim pushed both of her accounts. Yeah, I noticed, man. She was like 250 million power. Like, what the hell? Okay, next is 3202. Oh, you HK freeze! I remember you man, I do remember you from our KVK together. I do remember you from our KVK together. Of course I remember you man. I remember you, like you put up quite a the nice fight. You're actually HK Freeze. Also remember Mrazi by the way, this guy was 100% in 32 12. 100% this guy was in 32-12 So is Itachi like the biggest guy that you have? He should be because he's almost 300 million power so I don't know if, of anyone else God damn he's grown so powerful God damn was he actually 300 million power when we were fighting? I feel like he was way weaker like he was about 150 or something I remember Mara Itachi 100% wasn't 300 million whenever we were having our KVK3 though, 100%. He was definitely into the 150 million power range or something. Third to eight is in our KVK. Oh yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. Because I was really getting confused. Like, they were definitely not the same power. So your main alliance is 8.8 .8. Actually you had like two main alliances Did you not have like two main alliances? Yes, you are You have too many, too many alliances And the next one? Is 255 million as well? Brother, like he has two accounts One 300 million and one 250 million something Itachi is going crazy man, this guy is going ham, what the hell? Oh man, you must love being in the same kingdom as this guy, I ain't gonna lie. Like this guy coming back must have been epic. I remember someone telling me that he left you with about 500 billion resources before he left. Like just how crazy is that? Just how crazy is that? It's 0, 02 and 08, 13, 17. Versus 97, 94, 12, and 93. You know, man, I really want to see 0, 2, and 12 duke it out again. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I feel bad about the fact that uh, 32, 0, 2 just lost the previous KVK just because 3207, which is us, existed. I ain't gonna lie. I really want to see 3202 and 3212 just have another KVK. And I don't know why, but I feel like 3202 is gonna destroy 3212 this time. Like, I'm sorry, I, I was in 32-12, I know that 32-12 are really powerful, but I do really believe that in KVK3, the biggest reason why 3202 lost versus 12 was because 96 joined the fight. Fighting 97 will be fun. Is 97 really that powerful? Is 97 really that powerful? I have zero information on them. I literally have zero information on these guys. Like, are they really this powerful? Because you're making it seem as if the 3212 isn't like the main attraction anymore. So they have a. Th oh, okay. 10 billion alliance. And what is the secondary alliance? 
5 billion. So about 50 billion strong. Yeah, about 50 billion strong as a, as a, as a kingdom. Zero two is gonna do it up with ninety seven. Yeah, don't, don't you actually isn't twelve really the most powerful alliance right now? The most powerful kingdom because in KVK three they were like in KVK three thirty two twelve was literally the main enemy in my opinion. Like I ain't gonna say like the rest of the guys didn't put up a fight. Ninety six was amazing, but at the end of the day, thirty two twelve was just a whole new level of beast. So. Okay, Aaron, let's get back into your... 3212 is a small fry compared to 97? Really? Also 17? Okay, let's go check 32... Let's just go check that as well, man. 3217 is it? 600 and 600. Now let's go. Let's check this one as well. Okay, let's go. Let's see what we have in here. Let's see what 17 is all about. Se oh, okay. 11 bill. They're actually 11 billion power, man. The main alliance is 11 billion power. And the secondary alliance is 7 billion power. So, yeah, these guys are definitely powerful. You're right about that. But is, is 3 to 12 not, not like that powerful anymore? That did, did they like fall from grace? Because I feel like they had three main alliances. So, technically, they should have a lot of power. How's your gem arches? Uh, I should really <laughs> make some of them right now. <clears throat> 32 to is first place with 900 million, followed by 3217 with the difference though. Holy cow! Holy cow! Look at the difference between first and second place. Like this thing is crazy. The difference though, 3197 is 4th, 3213 is 5th, I wonder where 3208 is, <laughs> and 3207, like is 3207 last place or something? Oh never mind, 3207 isn't here, what, what am I talking about? But I wonder where 3208 is though. Holy hell. <laughs> this is crazy. Like okay, Fierce did send me the screenshot, but I didn't pay attention to it. I didn't, I didn't check them. Uh, we're currently pushing. Like you guys are 900 million. What are you even pushing about? You won. <laughs> you won, man. What are you even pushing about at this stage? At this point, man. Okay, so this is the third alliance. F12 should be really. <clears throat> yeah, 10 billion. Like how can you not say that these guys aren't powerful? Secondary alliance is also six billion. Okay, wait a minute. Did this actually happen? Did thirty two twelve actually go into two main alliances? Like there were three main alliances. It was C, it was D, and it was F. So where the hell is C though? Did they did they just like send members away? What just happened right now? Because where is C twelve right now? I'm, gonna, I'm not seeing any C12 plus A. It was A as well. I can see A though, but where is C12? What happened to 3202? 3212? What did they lose like one alliance right now? Like these guys were definitely three main alliances whenever we fought them in KVK3, so I, I'm really not understanding this. Why, why did they shrink? Like what? What just happened? How strong is thirty two or two main alliance? They were about ten bill. They were about ten billion power. And they're saying that the main enemy from of thirty two zero uh, two is gonna be thirty one. 97 rather than 3212 which I feel like 3212 I don't know man but I feel like uh, 3202 has a bone to pick with 3212 because they really lost KVK 3 against them the reason why they lost though truth be told is because well 
it was 32-07, which is us. We did really poorly, so they lost versus 32-12. But if it was me, I would really want to fight 32-12 again to get back my revenge, man. I, I would not want to fight anyone else. <laughs> like, we lost against 32-01 in KVK2, and I wanted to fight 32-01 again. We lost versus 31-96, and I wanted to fight 31-96 again. Like, if, if I lose against a certain alliance, that's who I want to fight. We are at 922 million right now and 17 is also pushing. But 17 is like literally 200 million away from you guys, like 250 million. So it's kind of like <laughs> I don't I don't feel like they can even reach you no matter how much they push. I feel like the difference is way too huge. If anything, I feel like you've pushed so much that they should be demoralized. Oh, Sky is back. Like, I'm seeing some Sky guys trying to put in the work. Also, these flags haven't fallen just yet. Crazy. Crazy how they haven't fallen just yet. So I cannot wait to see uh, Purple fight Red right now. I really feel like they should. Like, if, if they want to have any shot into this KVK, they really gotta, like, start fast pushing. Itachi got like 300 million points for 3202. Yeah, exactly. Like, the guy is literally 300 million power. Like, just how crazy is that? Can you imagine? Like, the guy literally put more work than the whole kingdom. The guy has put in more work than the whole kingdom has done. It's crazy. Like, I've seen kingdoms do less than 300 million. And the guy did that by himself. Like, how crazy is Itachi, man? I've heard, like, I heard stories about the guy, but I never knew that he was this crazy. I heard stories about the guy, like, they kept telling me stories about how if Itachi came back, they would win 100%. And whenever he came back, I ain't gonna lie, man, the moral boost that 3202 got from that, it was crazy. And I feel better that at the end of the day, they, they, they still lost, but... Itachi just wasn't ready back then, like, he was only 150 million. But now he's 300 million, and he's definitely gonna kick ass. And I will definitely love to see that KVK. Like, if that KVK happens, I told Connor and I told everyone, you guys keep me posted because uh, the most important moments, I really want to be streaming them. I really want to be streaming those things. <clears throat> we also get 2 times 50 k expansion from mobilization, means we can push more. Yeah, uh, the bad thing... I ain't gonna lie, man, like, that's amazing because... Our mobilization went terrible. Look at this. Look at this. Like, we only got 50 million. Like, we only got 50k. I ain't gonna lie. Our mobilization event was pathetic. If I may put it into words, in my opinion, like, our mobilization event was pathetic. We'd be terribly bad in that. I really wanted that, that 50k, and instead we didn't get it, and it sucks. It literally sucks. I don't know if I have, I do feel like I got 150k, but I wanted two of them, just so I could push more. It sucks, man, like our mobilization event really sucks, I hope that next time we do better, otherwise I would be really disappointed. We have more than half of our guys right here, look at this. We have more than half of our guys in here who haven't done a single mission. Look at this. Zero. Zero, 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 and I'm like, who are these people? Like, we are supposed to win a KVK with people not really hard trying into this. Like, it's one of the best free rewards events that exist. So why would you not want to do it? Why would you not want to do it? But I guess my my alliance members just don't think the same way as I do so it really sucks ours too we are just one level away from hell blueprint choice chest and I want my speeds man. yeah I want it man I want I wanted my I wanted my rewards as well look at this like look at look at this stuff formation chest level 7 
you would go for the 50k into level 8 or maybe like yeah probably I would go for the conquest as well true 100% and yeah there's just so many amazing stuff that you could just get just just by being just by having an active alliance but that just doesn't appear to be the case by the way all of you watching right now if you could drop a like it would be amazing because YouTube loves likes I would really appreciate that In 3206, hey Zoro, what up man? It's been a while, ever since the last time that I saw you here. In 3206, we got 200k in Alliance Quest, and minimum for every player was 1700 points. That is crazy. I mean, it's amazing. It, it's amazingly crazy. Like, we usually have like a limit, or, or like, a, at least in 3207, everyone who got below 1000 points wasn't allowed into the next mobilization event. And I feel like it's only fair. In my opinion, it's only fair. Like, if you if you're not gonna like pull your weight, why? Like, at least you could get like 500 points. Like, at, at the very least, if if half these guys got like at least 500 points, we could have gotten the the most the, the best rewards. But now we're just stuck like that. It 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 went up to the point where I wanted to do extra quests just for me to like catch up. But at the end of the day, no matter what I do, I really cannot catch up with like five thousand points of my own so the difference is kind of like way too big right now I mean, purple is pushing I'm not seeing any fights but purple is pushing Okay, so they're burning like four flags at the same time in here, they're burning this flag. I'm kind of like surprised that they're not building a flag in here to keep like pushing on this uh, direction as well, but I guess that they maybe like are, are trying to like just burn down this zone. They're not exactly trying to push too hard into like a straight line. My lands got level 18 last time, but this time only level 14 because power gaining wasn't allowed. You know man, when it comes to rewards like F power gain, like I don't even know why they make this type of rules. Like I would want at least level 10. At the very least I feel like we should owe it to ourselves to get level 10. Maybe level 18 is not always possible, but goddamn level 10 should be possible. There's just so much amazing rewards that you can get just by having an active alliance and it's crazy that uh, that so many people actually under evaluated this event. They just didn't even try, they didn't even try. Like if you see these guys that have zero points, the funny thing is that, I don't know, where are they? The funny thing is that they haven't even tried, like they're like zero out of zero. They didn't even try to maybe get a quest, maybe get it done, but maybe they failed. It's okay. Like I, I, I failed three quests because I was like at work. It's okay, but at least try it out though. At least try it out. Yeah, I would say the minimum should be 1500 points per person, but even then we had 17 per person, we still were three in alliance quest i feel like yeah but at least 1k like at least 1k if we can have a minimum a minimum of 1k 100 percent we could get at least level 14 and that's all i want like level 14 is good enough but of course the higher the better but we should have like at least a minimum and people who don't do well they should get kicked out yeah i feel like they should do the same 3207 did the same lee louch 3207 did the same. They kicked everyone out who didn't participate into the event. So I feel like it's only fair. Like we really shouldn't be this forgiving. If you, if you make a weak alliance, it's gonna be a weak kingdom, and you're gonna really suffer the consequences. Like I didn't came in 3207. <laughs> well, I didn't came in 3152 to actually be done like this. Of course, I'm not like putting all of them under the rug. Like I. A really good bunch of people in here are really hard trying and I, I really want to give them, like I said, 
I'm, so, I'm gonna stay in 3152 for at least 3 kvks even if you lose all 3 kvks I'm still gonna stay in here for 3 kvks because I want to give them a shot because I got all my friends in here and I really want to give them a shot but if after 3 kvks we just don't prove to be good enough then uh, of course I will just go for like a better place so I got nothing I love my friends and everything but at the end of the day I'm also looking to get shit done in, into this game are you into the top one alliance? No, I'm actually into the second alliance at the moment because the first rank alliance, uh, first of all, it's full, and the second of all, all my friends are into the second alliance. But I really am waiting for that KVK. Once that KVK starts, I'm get, I'm, I'm gonna lend myself a spot into the, into the first rank alliance, and I'm gonna stick to that. Like I'm not exactly gonna. Hey, I, I'm looking to grind, man. I'm looking to grind. I just came in here right now and I really cannot exactly ask them for a spot into the first rank alliance that easily because I still haven't put in the work to deserve a spot there but once I do I'm gonna get be getting that spot I'm gonna be getting that first rank alliance spot and I'm not gonna quit it anymore like it's only the beginning so I'm I'm, I'm being humble about my stay in uh, 32 3152 but uh, once the KVK starts I'm landing that spot into the first rank alliance and I'm gonna be staying there and I'm gonna be earning that stuff like, I want those chests, man. I want to go in here, I want to see those chests. Like, where are the chests? I'm not saying that I'm not getting any chests in here, but... Yo. 1 and 2 is such a big gap, yeah. Well, normally they're really, like, normal in power, but I feel like the big spenders of the kingdom are into the other lines. Green Dude says, actually, 2910 used to do this, but... Uh, then they don't actually do that anymore because we have empty spots in our alliance. I mean, yeah, but my alliance, my first rank alliance is full right now, so I really cannot land the spot. Even if I want to, if I go and apply, I don't feel like I would get accepted. I would just not get accepted because every single time that I'm checking them, they are always 148 full. Like, they're always full, not even one single spot free. Not even one single spot free. Dracul, welcome brother, welcome, welcome. How you been, man? I've, I've said hi to you a couple times on the Lambo stream. I'm glad to see you back in here, man. I'm glad to see you finding some time and actually drop by. I appreciate it. Also, yes, just like Lee Lao just saying, if you are enjoying the stream or even if you're not enjoying the stream, drop that like button. <laughs> well, if you're not enjoying the stream, just drop the dislike button, bro. You get the point. I would love it, like, well, not me, I don't really care, but YouTube does, and if YouTube does, then, uh, <laughs> I guess I care as well, <laughs> like, to me, you people being here is good enough, you people saying hi is good enough, but YouTube just doesn't think that way, YouTube is like, yeah, they're here, but do they like it? I'm like, but they're here, yeah, but do they like it? But, 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 but they're here, so that means that they like it. Yeah, but did they hit the like button? So, you know, YouTube is crazy, man. YouTube is kind of crazy with that, so what are you gonna do? <laughs> what are you gonna do, man? YouTube is the big guy, we gotta uh, abide by his rules. We can, we have no say in that. Like, YouTube says you need likes to keep going. I guess we're gonna get likes. <laughs> <clears throat> Drop a like if you think Avery is a noob. No, 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 no. I'll get like 1,000 likes. No, no, no. Like, I would love the likes, but hey, that's that's really, really, really offensive. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, I've seen you on the Lambo stream. Yeah, I try my best to come into the Lambo stream, Lefty the Spartan, and everyone else's stream, but sometimes life is really busy, so I really cannot join every single stream that they make but i try my best to, to, to come by man i try my best to come by how the hell did you how the hell did you push 40 million into like half an hour man how the hell did you push 40 million into half an hour like what the hell is 3202 man these these people are crazy these people are crazy though.
What the hell? How did you guys... 3202 is literally crazy though. All interaction is good for YouTube algorithm. Also Sam Gallo, welcome to the stream brother. It's nice to have you here today as well. But you're right about it. All interaction is good for YouTube. Like, dislike is good, yes. So at the end of the day, YouTube is like, hey, if these guys care enough to dislike this, uh, this video, it means that they are watching it. It means that they dislike this guy so much that they are willing to come into YouTube, into our platform, watch the video, see the ads. So at the end of the day, YouTube is like a winner. I'm the only loser in this, like because people don't like me. But at the end of the day, <laughs> YouTube is like, hey, this guy's putting in the work. He is the top one most hated guy into the whole YouTube channel. So <laughs> this was only the first day of training. Crying. By the way, I'm all 52 member, a lot of my friends are there. You're joking, right? You're joking. Oh, that's that's crazy, man. Like, I didn't even know that. I didn't even know that you were... Nice. Come back. Now. <laughs> you deserter. Well, does it, is it like with a Z or is it like is it like this or is it like with an S? I guess it's with an S, but it does. It also does feel like I'm telling him that he's a dessert. So maybe he's taking it like he's sweet or something. Never mind. <laughs> Let's get back into seeing what what the hell is going on. So purple is still trying to push a little bit. Imagine being in the lines where Itachi pushed 300 million power. Imagine. <laughs> True, man. You should have gone to 3202. I really should have gone to 3202, man. These guys are crazy, though. But nobody invited me. Like, truth be told, nobody invited me in 3202. So, to my, to my, I guess, justification, nobody invited me. And that's why I didn't go. Like, if you're not invited into a wedding, you just cannot go there. That's kind of the way it is, right? What is the location? Uh, the location right now is Kingdom 12151 and we are seeing Le Green Dude's KVK basically. Green Dude is in this kingdom right here, well this coalition right here, he's in Kingdom 2910 and I promised him that I would watch his KVK yesterday and that's exactly what we're gonna do. And I'm gonna be trying to do that with a lot of kingdoms like whenever we have a good KVK going on I will really try my best to make a stream about it because I really want to support the whole game. I want to try my best to do that. How many kill points do you have right now? A good question. I have 33 million. I got like 25 million kill points less KVK. Not like the best, but not, not, not the worst either, considering that we fought like three days. Well, less than three days. We fought like... Well, we lost in, in the first four hours, but then we did a few skirmishes here and there the, in the, into the second and third day. So that's, that's all we did. But I'm hoping to get myself to at least like 100 million this KVK. Like, I at least want to complete 100 million. But at the end of the day, it is a season of conquest KVK. So I got to take into account that I'm going to be fighting a lot bigger guys than I am. So at the beginning, the first few seasons of conquest aren't exactly going to be that easy for me. But I'll, I'll try my best. Is this what our KVK is going to look like? Um, I guess, yeah. Well, it depends on what map you pick. Like, it does depend on what, what map you pick, but what type of KVK you pick. But yeah, normally, yes. I feel like this is the most loved type of KVK there is. So, one are usually, yeah, I feel like it's gonna be the coalition one. And it's gonna be this map. Exactly this map. At least from what I've seen, it, it's kind of like the most loved type of uh, KVK. I might be wrong though, but from what I've been seeing.
<clears throat> 52 wasn't good enough at the time after KVK2 we were done because we played versus 3159 check out 59 Okay, this is like the secondary lines though. Where's the first ring lines? <laughs> Holy crazy mama. Genie, like who's like the genie from Eludine or something? What the hell? Like 500 million power. Who is this guy? Almost 10 billion kill points by the way. Crazy. Crazy ass dude. Like he is the alliance you have abu red by the way i remember this good this dude 100 percent okay i don't know the rest of them like in terms of like names but god damn these people are powerful i really hope that we never fight them because it would be like super crazy to fight these guys like they're like next level powerful like i don't even know if i could trade with any of them like i'm not seeing a single guy in here who I could literally trade blows with. Like they would literally kick my ass. Not a single guy under 40 million. Crazy. Crazy. Literally crazy. In 32 or 6. Heroic Anthem is the most liked. Yeah, from what I've seen, it is. It, it, it's usually the map that I see the most. Usually they really do like this one the most. <clears throat> Zoro says in 3206, you do not have to have a lot of power to be in the top lines, but we need a lot of kill points. You can check me, I have only 22 million kill points and 75 mi uh, 22 million and 77 million kill points my name is well done uh, Wulad Kad okay we can go in 3206 right now at the end of the day I really want to see what 3206 is up to as well so why not excuse me for misspelling your game name wrong by the way Genie is a 1960 player easy now is it like a secondary account or something or did he just maybe like quit 1960 and came into into 3159 okay i'm not sure if i can find you that easy john pork's dead by the way this guy is into my into my discord and i love him he's an amazing dude you got Sven as well. Sven isn't on my Discord, but he should be. Bad guy Sven. Bad Sven. Now I'm not sure if Jat Maga, I remember this guy. Now I'm not sure if I can find your account, man. Like, uh, I really gotta. It's gonna be hard for me to find your account in here. It would be easier if you maybe, like, send me a message. I'll try my best, but if I miss it. It ain't gonna be easy, like, my eyes are literally effed up from, I woke up like today like 6am, so you gotta take that into account as well. Okay, I'm gonna try going up one more time if I can see you, but if I cannot, then you will really have to excuse me if I cannot do that. If I can't find you. You are 22 million powers. I guess I should be looking at power rather than the name itself. 28? No. Close though. 28? I'm seeing a couple of 28 million guys. I'm not seeing any guy be 22 though. Come on, where are you? Because now this feels like a personal challenge. Oh, is this you? 
Yeah, this is you. You have a lot more kill points than I have, man, so congrats on that. Like, you've definitely done a, a better job in 2kvks than I have. Really congrats on that. Like, should be told, I have a long way to go. Like I said, into the, this season of Conquest, I'm really hoping to get my hands into like a 100 million kill points. If I can if I can do that, I would be pretty happy with myself, but at the end of the day, I gotta take into account that I'm really weak when it comes to like Season of Conquest guys, so that also matters. Should be told, that also matters. I'm hoping my kill points improves, I'm in 1029. You're with Lambo, man, I'm pretty sure that you will improve, like the guy is amazing. He is amazing at giving tips, he's amazing at knowing what to do, so I, I feel like 100% you have all the support that you need in order to improve yourself. <clears throat> in my opinion, I feel like you will 100% make it. I don't feel like you will have any trouble with, uh, with that. Okay, I don't know why, but it doesn't appear like these guys are trying to burn the enemy as fast as they were before. I'm not even... Like, look at this. These flags... Right now, they should have been burned, man. Like, they really should have... Also, they should have put, like, a flag in here as well. I don't exactly know what the strategy is, but... I'm not exactly seeing them push... Mm. Why are they not fighting in Kingsland? This is what I'm trying to understand. Like, this is only the second day of the Kingsland, and I'm seeing them be really AFK when it comes to this, uh, this fight, man. Maybe they're all sleeping or something, but. 100 million isn't bad, but your kill points aren't bad because it's all tier 5s and tier 4s. I know, but at the end of the day, man, it, it's, it's kind of like not good enough. Like, I'm not saying that I'm not happy with how I did in KVK3, but KVK1 and KVK2 were super bad for me, so I have a lot to catch up with. Also, Odin, welcome to the stream today, man. It's been a while. I need to improve my infantry and my archer armaments. Yeah, I need to improve my uh, infantry as well, like, look at this. I need those golden stuff, man. I only have epic, unfortunately. I need those golden stuff, man, 100%. I got my witch lineage yesterday, so I I'm happy on that, but at the end of the day, I need the better equipments. Like, this is not good enough. If I'm gonna be fighting into KVK, you need the golden equipments. At the very least, yeah, you need the epic, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy that I at least have the, the very least, but... I do need that. And as far as armaments go, there's a lot of work to be put into armaments as well, should be told. There's a lot of work to be put into that too, man. Mm, what do we have to do? Open 8 silver chest, 5 resource item, 5 tombs of knowledge. Okay, purchase some stuff in here, never mind. Okay, so 5 tombs of knowledge and 5... Where's the resources? Because I want to get those 100 daily gems. Uh, what? You always want to be getting those. Go in here. Let's go with this one. Okay. Heal 50 troops. Okay. Done. Okay, what next? Defeat one barb troop on the map. I will be doing that a little bit later. And uh, defeat five barb troops on the map. Okay. Five silver chests. We gotta do that as well. Okay. So we really got a hard try into getting those daily gems right here. Never miss them. I, I try my best to never miss them. After Helm, go for the globes. I got the set brutality, but yeah, you're right. I definitely should go for the golden glove, uh, golden stuff, man. It's just I don't have anything right now on me, and that's why we should have done the alliance mobilization event because I'm pretty sure it, it would have helped me quite a bit. 
Let's see if we have anything in here to do. Okay, this is all only epic stuff, but whatever. Warpath is gonna reset in zero zero. I want to make sure to get those golden keys because I really do need them. I really do need those golden keys. How far away are you? Four minutes. So I'm gonna be using this march to be killing those five barbs, I guess. And I also need to finish my croc ceremony, but not today, because I really don't want to waste any AP for my inventory right now. I want to try my best to not waste any AP for my inventory at the moment. Problem with the lion's mobilization is that only the top lions usually gets far. You're right about that, but at the end of the day, man, uh, it, it, it's it's kind of like it's on people. Like not all the quests require you to like spend money or spend gems, so there's definitely quests that are like free to play. So you can definitely get stuff done if you want to. But most of the people who do that, they're just like too lazy to do the event. Because you cannot tell me that it was impossible for our, our my guys right here to do the alliance mobilization event. Like, look at them. They haven't done a single quest right here. Not a single quest. Like, you cannot tell me that these guys right here, they, they just uh, were unlucky. Because look at this. Defeat 180 barb troop. 100% possible for a free-to-play guy. This is 100% possible for a free-to-play guy. This is 100% possible for a free-to-play guy. Also the same, like uh, increase your power by 110k, okay you will waste a few speed ups, maybe you, you don't want to do it, but also doable, also doable, also doable, like nobody is doing stuff, like these guys aren't even trying, so you cannot come in, basically say that it's because, uh, it's because we're not the top lines, it's because people are lazy, truth be told, people are just lazy man also thank you green dude for providing me with this amazing of sky versus like it's basically uh, CN oh I see now what they're doing this is a really good thing like I s oh this is such a nice flag I didn't even notice this I didn't even notice this man this is such a nice flag. This is a really nice flag. God damn, this is a super nice flag. That's epic right there that they thought about doing it. I got my Liu Che to level 60, my Hyo Q Bing is to level 57. Okay. Liu Che is definitely good. Is Hyo Q being any good? Is it worth it for the meta? I have zero information on that. I've seen him being used, but I don't know how good or bad he is. Like how how much of a primary uh, commander he should be, or primary like objective. But definitely Liu Che to sixty is nice. You just gotta make sure that you give him the sculptures now, though. I'm in 3284 and we are about to finish the event but we still have 50 members, 0 or 0 attempts. Yeah, you know man, uh, in 3207 what Ares did and I feel like it was the best decision he ever made is that he kicked off, he kicked everyone out who wasn't, um, he kicked out everyone who had 0 out of 0 attempts. Actually everyone who had under 500 points. Everyone who had under 500 points, he just kicked them out, so they didn't get the rewards in the very end because they didn't deserve to get the rewards, and I, I, I can understand that. Like, if you want to get the rewards, you got a hard try, man. You can't just stand in the back and just uh, receive the rewards for doing absolutely nothing. And I feel like one of the main reasons that 3207 had were people who were literally AFK. For people who were just not doing anything, but they were still expecting the rewards, they were still expecting to win KVK, and they were like, yo, if you do not work, if you do not put in the work, how can you even expect that stuff? Like, it's crazy, in my opinion. It, it's super crazy. That's exactly what we're doing to people with under 800 points. 
That's one of our members. Yes. And you should be doing that. People need to realize that uh, you just won't be handed stuff for free. If you want a strong kingdom, every single member, sh every single member should be strong enough. I can understand people not being able to complete the event maybe once, twice, or three times, but it's just not normal for people to be AFK every single time. Personally, I would literally hate it. So I feel like that is the best decision that they've ever made. Where's the location of that fight? Um, well, you can see the coordinates right here. I don't feel like I've hidden them anymore, have I? Or I yeah, I actually hidden them. Never mind. Actually, let's do it like this. Let's actually do it like this. Just for the moment to... Boom. Okay, so... Back into the game. This is where the, the fight is taking place, basically. But it's kind of like Kingsland. And it's right here. That's where they were fighting, but uh... hey, there's there. Oh, never mind. It's FPX again. I thought they were the enemy was going for a fight, but that doesn't appear to be the case. I guess these guys are just into dead downtime right now, so they're not exactly fighting anymore. I ain't gonna lie. I was really hoping to come today and uh, see for some very interesting fights taking place, but it appears like everyone is just taking their time with this KVK. Like, wind isn't even trying right now, wind isn't even trying, fire is trying to push wind back and they're trying to kill both gates. Now I don't know where the wind active hours are but it appears that it's like super possible for this to happen. <clears throat> yeah, and if they get rid of the, the flag, territory won't be connected and cities will be zeroed. Yeah, it's a really good... Well, in order for this territory to be unconnected, you gotta do it like this. So it's kind of like one, two, three, four, five, six. Like it's at least six flags. So it will definitely take a while. It's definitely gonna take a while. But you can think about it like this. You're basically burning enemy territory from all sides. So whenever they wake up, they will need to make up for the territory that they lost before they can actually focus on uh, gaining new territory. So. That actually does matter, it's a good strategy. Okay, so I need to kill. Okay, so I need to kill five barb troops just for the event, for the for the quest. So let let's actually go and do that. Also at the same time, I need to collect a few gems. So here's one. Here's two. You know, I love the, the fact that nobody's collecting gems right now, so it's like super easy for me to, to find some gems around together. Here's three. Oh, this is such a nice place. Look at this. Only because my old kingdom had uh, one, 1600 point target plus training quests are the easiest and uses a lot of speed ups, including the event always starts before pass opening. That's me use my speeders for alliance event and did go well. Okay, uh, you need to understand that usually as a free to play guy, you, you try to do your best to do the collecting gem quests, uh, to collect and collecting resources quests, and sometimes even killing barbs, which does use a lot of speed ups and a AP points, but. You don't go for the stuff that require you to like use gems or use speed ups that much, man. I I try my best to always pick the the easiest quest, like quest with like 90 points. It's okay, like 
at the end of the day, if I get if I can get close to like 1,000 points, I'm good enough with myself. Like I'm not exactly looking for those huge objectives like 1,500. Like that that's maybe impossible for me as a free to play, but it's not impossible for me to get 1,000 points. So let's be honest. Like 1,000 points should be easily obtainable, in my opinion. So basically, that's that's basically what I'm looking for. Like I'm I'm, I'm looking for for that amount of power. Like I feel like if everyone did like close to 1,000 points, or even maybe like 700 points, like even 700 points in as a as an average, it would have been super nice. As a minimum, I'm sorry. Like if everyone, each of these guys did like 700 points, 100%, we could have gotten at least level 15 at least level 16 it was possible but because they didn't do shit here we are struggling about it so you can only guess how I feel about that stuff in this KVK I feel like Red and uh, Kingdom and Sien uh, Kingdom are allies no, uh, it, well, yeah, red and sea are allies, true, and uh, blue and purple are also allies. Okay, so now let's let me just find like a gem spot, and we can go back and see what what the KVK is going. Let's see if I can maybe find like a level two gem spot. It's kind of like way nicer. I I would rather get me 22 gems than 11. So if I can find me a level two gem spot, which I just found, it's amazing. Good, good, good. The rewards are actually really good, though. So truth be told. Yeah, I feel like that's basically what they gotta do. So they gotta go, like go like this in order to to kill all of this territory. So they they have a lot of work to be done. I don't know if it's gonna be possible within the amount of time that the enemy is uh, sleeping, but they at least gotta try. Like they at least gotta try. Like Sky seems like pretty AFK right now. They're not doing anything, so why not? I just wish that maybe like you guys could wake up though. Who's the alliance that's holding this? Weak alliance. Yeah, so 7.5 bill is holding this one. I don't know, man. I guess I'll, I'm, I'm gonna be seeing what these guys are gonna be acting like whenever it's like their active hours. I just hope that they just haven't given up on the KVK yet because if they have, it's gonna be like super sad. Well, red and cyan are a team, purple and blue are also in a team, and we are against cyan and red. Wait, what I showed in the screenshot is that wind will destroy the territory in red. Huh? Wait a minute. The wind will destroy the territory in red? Oh! 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 oh. I see! I see! I see! I see now! Never mind. Yo! Now I see what you're going for. Yes! God damn! That's actually an amazing plan, man. This is actually worth watching. 100% this is worth watching man Now I see what you mean If they do this it's gonna be ma I thought that they needed to like count out like 1 and 2 But you're right if they cut it up in here it's gonna be 100% Donezo Holy hell that's a really good strategy though
Look at what I sent you. Um, okay, let's just go and check it out real quick though. Because at the end of the day, we gotta be looking at the KVK that I said it's gonna be happening. So basically, people will be zero soon. Hey, they're your enemies, man. So you should not be sad about it. You should be happy. They are your enemies, brother. You should actually be like super happy about it. So they're not fighting here. So I guess this is, this is a top versus bottom type of fight. But these guys pick the same color, though. Did they just pick the same color? Yes, they did. These guys pick the same color. Holy hell. Crazy though. I know, I know. Why are you sad about it, man? <laughs> Why are you sad about it? Like, like, they are literally your allies. You should be hoping that they lose so that you can win. Like it's it's kind of like part of the game. Like I'm not I don't think that I, f I don't feel sorry about them losing their power, but it is for them to actually because they made like a really bad decision. Like I didn't I didn't think about this, and I guess nobody else in here thought about it as well. But yo, it's kind of like at the end of the day, man. This is the game. Like if you make a bad decision, you will get punished for that. But you will learn from your mistakes, and you will be better next time. So I really cannot wait for these two flags. Is it like two flags? Like I see, it's actually one, two, three, four. It's actually four flags. It's actually four flags. They're not even trying to burn this one anymore. They are really hard pushing into this and it's a really good strategy. But at the same time, you need to realize that uh, Red is trying to do the same to you. Like they are also trying to cut you guys here and here. And if they cut you, you're gonna be into like super big trouble. So you also gotta be, you also gotta watch out, man. Look at all your cities, though. All of these cities, you should also watch out. So I would say both CN and Blue are in in danger right at this moment. Purple and Blue are winning. You mean into the kingdom that you sent me? Because in here it appears like it's pretty much even now, like it's red versus purple right now, these moments, and uh, they're all racing to whoever can burn the flags better and faster. They are trying to burn everything that they can in here. Oh, they're nice. They're burning in here too. Okay, so I'm loving it. I'm loving what uh, Purple is doing. Like, unlike Red, who's only focusing up to like this point, they're really hard trying to burn everything that they can. Oh, this one is gonna burn though. It's gone. This one is gone for. So now Purple and Red are literally gonna be fighting each other. I don't know who's gonna place the flag first in here, but. Actually no, there's like three more flags, never mind. <laughs> never mind, there's there's still like a couple of more flags there. But I love what CN is doing. Red is taking a lot more time to, to burn some stuff. Meanwhile CN is, is kinda like picking a better path, so I'm liking it. I'm loving what they're doing here. Also, they're trying to push the enemy of the King's Land as well, so it's good. It's actually really good. They should do it. Like, they should be trying to burn the enemy down in, in as many positions as they can because once the enemy wakes up, they will need to recover what they lost before they can actually focus on. Oh brother, rip blue cities? Yeah, like if, if those guys do not wake up before red just uh, attacks everything, you will be in like super big trouble, man. 
you should never have a city into Kingsland. Like 100% never keep your city in, in Kingsland, man. When you go to sleep. You don't even know what's gonna go on, so you never should stay there. This flag is burning. This flag is burning. And well, let's see what else. Oh, <laughs> this guy though. He actually cut one up. He actually burned puppy. He actually burned one up. Nice of him. He actually caught one guy slacking and he was like, you're mine now. You ain't got your pals with you. said they're definitely putting in the work and I feel like this is probably like a shell alliance like they, they're just trying to I feel like what they are gonna try and do is that they will try to clear the territory right here and then they will just fill it up with like uh, the yellow shell alliance so that they can just post uh, place like multiple flags close to each other yeah like 100% they're just gonna try and use it as a shell Okay, so yeah, that's yeah, you're right. That's definitely what they gotta do. That is definitely what they gotta do. Yeah, I, I I'm checking just the picture that you sent me, brother, and you're right about it. Like this is what they should be doing. Like Red is trying to basically close them down in here, and trying to attack in here. And CN right now is AFK, but they should be trying to like push them off the Kingsland. But they're just AFK right now, and it, it's Purple's time to actually gain up some territory and they definitely are if anything I feel like they're pushing in here as well like they are literally pushing in here as well look at them like they're literally pushing everywhere they don't give a damn they are pushing anywhere to gain an advantage such a nice thing really. Okay, this flag is literally gone for though. Yep. They're fighting a bit? Uh, no, they're just burning in here. They are just burning in here, but... There's like two flags to burn right here. So there's like one flag, two flags, three... In order to cut them out, you need to kill like... Yeah, you need to kill like three flags in order to cut them out. Well, no, actually two. One and two. So once they burn this flag too, they should be actually in a really good position. They should be burning everyone after that happens. It's a really nice strategy. So, such a nice strategy that I will actually be watching this happen I really want to know I want I really want to see how this thing will turn out to be like this flag is 100% done for all they gotta do is burn one more and if they burn this one then it's just gone like the whole CN territory right here, the whole half of them, it's, it's literally gone. And either these cities are gonna get the hell out of the way or they're just gonna get burned to death. It's gonna be a huge victory for Purple. But at the end of the day, you also need to realize that ever since I started this stream, 
which was two hours ago, CN has been AFK, so either they're like at the very end of their sleepness and they will wake up in like any moment now or oh this guy just burned holy hell this guy just burned man it's crazy ouch This is, this is the king? Oh, they actually they, they actually burned the king down. Crazy. Holy hell. They actually burned the king down. He's gonna be like super pissed when he wakes up, but then why the hell would you keep your main city here, brother? Why the hell would you even keep your city here and just go home? Feeling like it's okay. Like, that's on you, man. That That, that is honestly on him I really cannot wait to see this flag burn down I really cannot wait for this flag to burn purple burn two more CM flags If they cut this one out though, like you need to understand like it's literally this whole territory gone. It's half their territory man, like this is this is gonna be like hella huge if it happens. If CN allows this to happen, and I feel like they will because they have nothing to do, but best they can do is literally save their own cities to get the hell out of the this zone right here. But if that happens, it's gonna be really huge for the CN. For the purple. Like it's such a nice cutting point right here. And then you need to realize that you can just keep pushing. You can just keep pushing right here. Just down the bottom. If you have the time, why not? Like, you have like what? One, two, three, four. Okay, you have a couple of flags though. Five, six, seven. So you have about seven flags to burn before the enemy shows up again. But you can definitely burn them up. It's definitely possible. You have three main alliances right here so we can definitely burn up two of them before they wake up yeah this one doesn't exactly matter as much right now I feel like the one that matters the most is this one but it's good to gain territory even though there's no cities in here so even if this one gets burned I don't feel like they can attack anything out of it but if this one burns right here, if this one burns and they just do not remove their cities, oh god damn, this is so done as a KVK. Like, purple is really gonna enjoy that. <laughs> They're gonna have the best time of their life. They're gonna be burning half the enemy coalition. Blue isn't doing too good against red, yeah. They really aren't. And green dude is actually in blue so I really wish him all the best but he really has a tough kvk ahead of him he really has a tough kvk ahead of him man okay this one is gone but there's just no cities in here anyway so wait a minute okay there we go the map updated there we go yeah if this thing burns it's gonna take about one hour it's gonna take about one hour for it to burn but if it, if it happens whew, the troubles the troubles though also they're trying to burn blue down here so they're trying to cut it up like this as well even though Here's like a better cutting point. I feel like they're also trying to do it here because at the end of the day it's like free cities everywhere. So why wouldn't you try about it? I just I don't understand how people can just leave their city here unattended and be like, yo, I'm just gonna go home. It's kinda like how? How can you do this? How can you leave the, your city right here, man? And just go to sleep. Like what are you what are you even thinking about?
If anything though, I feel like Blue should start to attempt to build a couple of flags here just to kind of like be a threat to the gate. Even though you technically might not be able to take it, you at least want to be a threat. Like you want to be like a continuous threat to the enemy. So some of their numbers are actually focused on you. Okay, 500 gone though. 500 is already gone. This one is gone as well. This one is 100% gone as well. But these two cities though, they're just shielded so you won't be able to take much from them. Okay, they're building in here, nice. They're trying to advance. That is good. Are they building a flag in here? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. So I'm loving the strategy so far. Sian's waking up. Ooh. Are they now? I'm not seeing any Sian guys waking up just yet. Yo, C12162 Kingsland tomorrow and 12 UTC. Um, I will be, I will not be home at that time. But if I can make it a little bit later, for sure, I can, I can take a look at it. You just gotta be coming here tomorrow and let me know again, man. If in case I forget. I mean, I'm only seeing like 10 guys from Sky, but they were trying to fight before as well. They just didn't get much done though. This guy is actually starting to gather up. I feel like they're just understanding that there's a threat in here, and either they gotta fight or they just really gonna struggle. But I don't feel like they woke up. Like this is definitely, they definitely haven't woken up just yet. There's just a couple of guys who are like finally online. Pass seven war going on there as well. Nice. I can definitely take a look at that, man. I can definitely take a look at that tomorrow. Only like 10 people are awake, not all of them, yeah. 10 people, sadly, they're just not enough. Like, I'm, I really cannot wait for this flag to burn right here. Like, I'm really gonna enjoy the show once that happens. At the same time, though, I'm really worried about Blue. Because I feel like Blue is really gonna suffer a hard fate, too. Sadly, I'm not seeing Win do anything. Like they're just not online right now. I'm not seeing them fight. I'm not seeing them try something. I'm, I'm just seeing them just be completely AFK. Rankings in that KVK, well, it's not mine, so I wouldn't really know about it. All I can see is like basically the collisions and everything else. So this is like the the CN, and this is my main account. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, brother. This is my main account. CNs are trying to ball up a little bit, are they? I don't feel like they will gain much by it though. If they're just fighting one, only one guy. Okay, so some of them are actually coming online right now. Some of them are actually coming online right now, man. I'm going home, I'm not gonna be able to watch the stream, sorry. <laughs> it's okay, man. You don't even have to say sorry about it. I completely get it. Like you've been here with me for like two hours, man. It's not your duty to to stay in here the whole time. <laughs> Thank you for the two hours. I really appreciate them. If anything, 
Okay, so Sky is definitely waking up a little bit. I guess they realize this is uh this is a really red zone right here. If this happens, they if this flag burns, they're really gonna they're really gonna suffer a hard fate. But that being said, uh, I feel like FPX are just gonna destroy them. They they just gonna gather up everyone. Yeah, look at them. They are more than ready to fight. They are just gonna gather up, man. 100%. Can you show me your commanders and gears? Um, not the best moment to do that, but sure. Just gotta wait up just like a moment though. Okay, real quickly. Well, this is my main commander, is my CPO, and my Liu Che is my secondary commander. 5521, my CPO is 5531. If you wanna go into the gear, I only have the epic one, sadly. Well, two golden ones, but I still need like four golden ones as well to complete it. So that's basically about it. I don't know what else I can show you, but that is my main and only march that I have for my season of conquest. Yeah, like Sky is waking up just a little bit, but uh, I don't feel like these guys are gonna care too much about it. They got the numbers. They still have the numbers. They still have the numbers. They still have the numbers. I don't feel like uh, the CN can do anything at all right here. Either they wake up all of them and start fighting, and even then, even then, I've seen purple be a lot more powerful. Even then, I've seen purple be a lot more powerful than CN, so they need red's help in order for that to happen. <coughs> Red though, it's pretty much doing the same thing to blue, so tomorrow is gonna be the huge fight when it comes to like CN versus red and that's where the the winner is gonna get be decided. Until then this is uh this is still like a fresh KVK. No winner just yet. Okay, sky is starting to ball up, like this thing is starting to get interesting. This thing is starting to get interesting. Nice boy, craft sun and moon ammo and KVK helm soon. Ooh, that's that's nice. That's nice. CN can do anything without the field. Yes, they just not. They're like in that downtime right now. They are in their downtime, so they are really gonna struggle for it. It's not possible for them to, to save this flag unless they just come online. But if the field gets burned, if they lose that, then it's gonna be like real trouble. For them. Let me just find you like a good gem spot here. I need to find a few gems. One more gem spot. There we go. Found it. Okay, also let's get this level 2 stuff done, let's come in here, I wanna get this warpath, golden keys before they reset, also, what do we even need right now? We need to open two more chests, so... One more silver chest right here, just to complete the daily quest. I need I need one more I need one more so what can I do 
Holy hell, no, I cannot be this unlucky. Okay, so if I collect... What do I need to collect? Like, stone? Was it stone that I need to collect? to collect just a little bit of gold like 12,000 gold I do collect 12,000 gold for me to get that quest man yep CN is awake are they I'm from TPE Alliance I'll be checking you out tomorrow man 100% if you if tomorrow I will be doing a live stream just come into my live stream man, and let me know and for sure I'll be checking out your, your KVK Oh yes, Sky oh okay, Sky is definitely coming online right now. But I don't, I'm not exactly seeing the big numbers from them, but they are definitely coming online. It's just a matter of time though before PLX just uh, just join forces. I'll give you an in-game message, of course. Sure, you can send me an in-game message. Sky just needs to come online because if this thing burns, like their whole KVK is just gone for. Like they definitely need it, need to come online. Hello, brother. Hello. Also, are they like trying to protect here as well or not really? Yeah, no, they're just trying to protect the the main base right here. Okay, I will be checking you out tomorrow though. I really cannot check you out today because I need to pay just a little bit of attention to the KVK that is already happening, but I can definitely check you out tomorrow. Yeah, Sky is just getting chased, man. They're just getting chased all over. Like, yes, yeah, some of them are online, but at the end of the day, it just doesn't appear as if they're they can fight this thing out. Flag is still burning, so nice commentary. Thank you, I appreciate it. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is like a huge war. They are burning up everything. They are burning everything from all possible sides. Okay, Sky is coming forward though. Let's see how this one goes. PHX really need to start sending some troops in. Like they just gotta start sending those troops in man for the fight. 
they want this to happen because they're in a really bad position but if they manage to kill this flag it's, it's gonna be like the ultimate win for them so they need to send the troops right here they they need to stop focusing anywhere else and they just gotta send the troops in here Okay, the numbers are coming in though. The numbers from PHX are coming in. Like, they're for sure not gonna give up on this flag that easily. And if you do understand the importance of this flag, of course you just cannot give up on that. Like, it's the most important objective right now. It's gonna cut out the whole enemy territory right here. And it's gonna make up for a huge victory if you... If, if, if it's possible. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of set faces from FPX, but that's because most of their troops were like really low powered. Oh, they were trying to rally the flag. I didn't even see that. I didn't see the fact they were trying to rally the flag, man. At the end of the day, whoever burns this flag down, like, just basically wins for the for the rest of the day. Yeah, I'm watching just that, man. I'm watching just that, just the fight. I'm watching just that. I wish the whole KDK could have been like this when I first started streaming, but it's okay. The flag is still burning, like 3k is already gone, so... 3k is already gone. Once this flag burns, boom! Shakalaka. It's the most important flag that, uh, that the Alliance has right now. And PHX just came out as winners right now. If both flags burn, they will say bye bye to Kingsland. Uh, yeah, that's true. That's true. Like, like I said, like uh, blue are basically in the same position. Blue and CN are basically in the same position. That is true. That is more than true. Well. We got a friend of ours in blue, so we are hoping that blue just doesn't get burned, but uh, yeah, they, are, they definitely made a really huge mistake of uh, letting their city into Kingsland. Like, that never should happen. You should never let your city in Kingsland, man. Whenever you go to sleep, you take your city into a safe place and uh, you teleport back tomorrow if you want to fight again. Teleports are important. You just to save a teleport you just cannot leave your city right here and just hope for the better whenever you wake up in the morning. That that's a really bad decision making.
999 hello brother welcome to the stream how you been man how have you been haven't seen you in like forever though almost 30 million power yes yes we are definitely working hard man we are working hard to get those stuff done well we still need like two more million but I'm, truth be told, I'm really not hard trying to get any bigger as well. Like, I'm waiting for that KVK to show up before I push my power. Before that, I'm probably not gonna be doing it. Because I don't wanna be like too powerful for that, uh, for that KVK matchmaking. I wanna be as weak as possible and I can push later. I can push power later, but I wanna be as weak as possible for that KVK. Extremely busy? I mean, that's life, man. I hope that everything is fine, though. I hope that at the end of the day, if everything is fine, the rest just doesn't matter. Health is important, economy is important, and then the rest of the stuff are easily fixable. And family. Like, health, family, and money. So, if those stuff is, are going well, the rest is definitely possible under 60 million is good enough higher power equals more requirement and for free to play not good yeah I'm probably gonna be staying around 30 to 40 million for a while I don't feel like I'm gonna be going any higher because I cannot pull the weight anymore like if I'm more than like 40 million power I really cannot pull the weight because I don't have good commanders or equipment so I plus I only have one March so because of that I don't want to be too powerful like if I want if I'm gonna be like 60 million power I want to have like at least two or three marches if I can have two or three marches with golden equipment and tier fives I can definitely be 60 million but otherwise there's no point in me being that powerful I would only uh, be negative I would not be able to, to pull my weight so that's where I'm hoping to stay for a while 40 million is a pretty good power, yeah. For, for a guy with only one march and with like, like right now I only have like epic equipment, man. So for this stuff, I feel like 30 million to 40 million is like the best place to be in. You don't want to be 60 million. It's too big, it's too powerful. I work on infantry march CPO, Liu, then do archers. Archer strongest commander in the game at the moment. Actually, I feel like CPO is pretty damn good when it comes to infantry. I might be wrong though, but I feel like infantry is still king. Only if the meta changed like recently, but uh, before that, it used to be like a meta of. It, it used to be like a meta of. Uh, of infantry. Before that. Yeah, PHX are basically trying to burn down both sides in here, so they're trying to make to like free territory. And if this flag's burned, uh, CN is gonna be in really huge trouble. But if this flag here burns quicker though, like the whole thing is just gonna crumble. The whole thing is gonna crumble. So I do realize that I, I feel like PHX really need to hard try for this flag. I feel like this is the most important flag for them to burn right now. No one else. What about you, man? How much how much power are you, 999? What is your power right now? Gain said that Liu is by far and that CPO Liu Che is by far the best march actually. Yeah, I like it was like that. Like I only I only uh well because and this guy said that the archers are the strong, the strongest commanders in game, so it made me think that maybe the meta, the meta changed or something. But yeah, like so far, I I know the same thing as you that uh, <clears throat> the most important commanders right now are CP and Liu Che. Oh, they're starting to defend. They are actually starting to defend. The rallies are going to start right now. The rallies are going to start because they're starting to defend, man. Are they gonna swarm it or are they gonna rally it? That, that's that's kind of like the question. I feel like they're just gonna 
Yeah, I feel like 100% of these are going to rally it. They need to back flag and then they will be fine for another 2 hours. Yeah, I will be checking like uh, the, the other KVK tomorrow though. I really cannot go there right now because there's such an important fight going on into this KVK that I really cannot afford to, to get disrupted. Twenty one point five million, nice, nice. Could spend a big tech, but I don't have enough time to recover quick enough for that push. Yeah, I'm not. Do I'm pretty much doing the same thing. I'm not hard pushing into stuff because I don't have enough speed ups to support myself. If I want to like do any hard push, I want to keep the training speed ups and the uh, and the healing and everything else. I want to keep them for whenever the KVK starts. Well, pre KVK, I'm gonna use. A lot of training speed ups, but and probably a few general speed ups as well. I think that he said that when Hermer Prime came out, you have you have to be prepared for power creep. Is Hermer Prime really that good right now? Like, is he actually like superior to CPO and everyone else? I don't feel like that's the case. I sent coordinates in that KVK. Lol. Yeah, we'll check it out, but. Uh, <laughs> I cannot check them out right now. I really cannot check that thing out right now. I'm sorry. Like, Two hours per day is not enough. Uh, yeah, I know. Tell me about it. Like, I'm starting to play like at least three to four hours a day. This is not the KUK. This is 151, though. Is this the one? Oh, yeah, it is. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I actually thought you sent me yours. My bad, man. My bad. Yeah, I'm, I'm playing for at least three to four hours the last few days. Trying to pick up my pace and trying to get my farms up and running. I'm trying to farm resources and everything else because I want to have those one billion resources for the KVK once they start. I want to make sure to be in a good spot. I really want to make sure to be in a good spot, man. Okay, the rally should be incoming though. I'm pretty sure that someone should be rallying soon enough. I don't know who's gonna rally and where it's gonna be coming from, but I'm pretty sure that they will be rallying the flag. Oh, Sky though, they're definitely getting in here. They are starting to teleport in. Flag is halfway there, yes, it's actually pretty close. Like, it's half burned, so it's maybe like, what, like one like at least half an hour in half an hour this flag should be gone if, if it keeps burning this flag should be gone and once that happens sky is going to be in huge huge trouble zug leong and herman archer attack plus 258 archer defense 162 archer health 135 like these are really good numbers though they're not bad numbers but i still like my CPO and Liu Che a lot better. Of course, it does depend on the items and technology and a lot of other stuff as well. So it's not only commanders, but I still feel like infantry is still superior. Sky is definitely waking up, like they're starting to fight. You're right, CN did wake up, man. CN did wake up. CN definitely woke up, just like a moment though. Just give me like a moment because I need to farm me some gems as well. Hmm. 
Come on, gems, where are you? Don't hide from me. Gem spots, stop hiding. Found one? Yes, I did. Oh no! I I forgot to recall. Can I make it in time? Is it possible for me to make it in time? I don't feel like it is. No, I cannot make it in time for me to get the 100 gems. There's another spot in here. And there's another in here. Nice. No, I forgot to... I forgot to take my troops back in time. God damn it. Let's see if it's gonna glitch out. Like, if this thing is gonna glitch out, it's possible. But I don't think like that's gonna happen. Let's see. Let's see. Hop nodes are gonna be faster. Uh, I had like 30 seconds. Hmm. It glitched out, so I got my I got my stuff. <laughs> I guess I was lucky enough for that. Okay. Like if you do not reset your your client, you can still make it. I guess. This event is invalid. Does it mean for my gems? Did I, did I get my gems or? I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. Okay. They're awake? Yeah, they're definitely awake. <laughs> they are definitely awake. I saw that. I I'm seeing it. Like, it finally got interesting, man. It finally got interesting. And should be told, uh, uh, PHX are actually in a bad spot because they have to come all the way from here to here so that they are a lot further from the they are a lot further from the fight than Sky is so of course Sky holds the advantage in terms of like field fighting but we'll see though <clears throat> if you want to hurt the most in open field Nevsky Jones is the best commander if you want good trade CP only UCHA yeah I feel like I want the, the good trades right now man because I'm too weak to do the most damage I'm too weak to do the most damage, so I, I'm just looking for positive traits. I, w I just want to make the make it like worth my while. Oh, okay. Okay, there. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. Good rally. Good rally. Good job. Good job, guys. The flag is burning yet again. <laughs> Good stuff right there. These flags aren't burning anymore though. They gotta start burning these flags again. Like you, they just should not stop with the rest of the flags. I know that they're gonna be cut off anyway, but you're gonna basically the more flags that you burn in here, the less territory people have to teleport to fight you in, in this zone. So the more flags that you burn, the better it is. Even though I know that they're just trying to cut out the enemy right here at the moment. Be right back, two seconds? Sure man, take your time, don't worry about it. Yeah, this, this thing is gone for. This thing is gone for like 20 more minutes, 100% in 20 more minutes. We're gonna see this whole, like, all the cities that are here, that are like AFK, they're gonna start burning down. Like, it's gonna be huge. It's gonna be like a huge defeat for the sky if this flag burns right now. If they cannot protect this, it's, it's gonna be a huge defeat for them. Okay, so let's see. Training. What else we got here? I don't need the formation chest. I need. I would rather go for the speed ups because formation chest for like legendary, for like rare now. Nah. Training speed ups here. 
Um, golden keys, crystal keys. I would rather go for the crystal ones. Formation chest. Honestly, formation chest. Inscribe legendary armament, 2% chance. F it, let's just go with this. Even though the. F Which one is the is best, in your opinion, man? I'm thinking about it. Like, the 15 hour training speed up is nice, but at the same time, now nah, we'll go for this one. Um. Yeah, that's that's basically all we have because we we weren't good enough to get the the most important levels. So God damn. So God damn. Attila Garrison. Oh, by the way, green dude, you're VIP 12 as well, man. Nice. I thought that you were like weaker than me in terms of VIP. But you're sure are doing as good as I am. Nice on that. Same newspaper for wood and for wood speed? Sure. But I can do that just a little bit later. Right now I really want to enjoy this fight. We can maybe like do the expedition. Let's see what we got. We can get the speed ups. Uh, I don't really care too much about this. I'm gonna get the golden one. Um, nothing else. Just get the Ethelflaed sculptures because we need them to get the the silver, and that's it. Ava, need to send you something? Sure, man. You, you can send it to me on, on the game or Discord or anywhere you want to send it to me. Of course. Thank you. Show two seconds, I will pause. Show two seconds, I will pause. Sorry, I didn't get that. If you want to Discord me, you can, if you want to send something on, uh, you can just Discord me, man. If you, if, if you want it to like be secret. If then you want it to be seen, you can just send it to me in the game, it's okay. Or maybe like the, the YouTube, whatever you want to do, it's okay. How important the flag is? Uh, if you kill this flag, all of this is basically gone so this is why this this flag is like super important it's gonna destroy the whole <coughs> stuff in here <coughs> show me your id um 1591 you can just pause the the video if you want to see it if you want to keep seeing it research just yet oh man sky is starting to push them back though sky is starting to push them back they really gotta reset they, they just gotta go home and they gotta reset and come back stronger because their troops are just spent right now war with oh when did this happen are you guys into a KVK right now? Oh, okay. Are you guys into a KVK right now, or? That's a nice trade, man. Like fifty million to seven million. That's a hell of a nice trade. That's a really nice trade. You had a, b a little bit more dead troops than the enemy though. You had a couple more dead troops than the enemy, but depending on what you were fighting for, it could have definitely been worth it. Oh, never mind. Oh, 
Oh, that's so sad. 10 points? No way. 10 points away from, from third rank. This is so sad, man. And the one who beat you is 3201, which, truth be told, I really wanted to beat these guys, man. I really wanted to beat these guys, 3201, in KVK2 and KVK3. So, goddamn, it, it's super sad that you just didn't manage to get yourself promoted. Holy hell, this is like super sad. This is like the saddest thing I've seen. <laughs> this is like the saddest thing that I've seen, man. <laughs> Holy hell. This is literally... It's like the saddest thing that I've ever seen. <laughs> oh my god. Like, this is just crazy. Oh man, you're definitely destroying the enemies though. Crazy. Kill points. But yeah. How much is your power? I never checked. You're almost the same power as me, but you have a lot more kill points though, so good job on that. You're definitely doing a better job than I am. Oh man, I would definitely rage. You're joking, you're like, like 10, 10 points, 10 points, man, that is just crazy. Can you just imagine? Everyone is thinking right now, like, why did I not do one more quest, just one more? Holy hell, the, the thing, you're right man, that, that definitely is, is super sad. <laughs> oh my gosh. By the way Moon, thank you for the subscribe man. I, I noticed this now man, but thank you for the subscribe, I appreciate it. And not even 1,000 from the top one. True, 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 true. But like the 10 points, man. God damn, the 10 points are like super sad. The 10 points are like super sad, though. <laughs> oh my gosh. The 10 points are super sad. Like, you could basically forgive yourself for, for losing with the 1,000 point difference. But you just cannot forgive yourself for like 10 points. We were top one, one hour ago, oh you just should have kept pushing just a little bit, but yeah I get it, like in your mind you never ever ever would have guessed that the enemy was just gonna push that hard, so I, I do get it, like it's easy to speak once it's over, but uh, I guess if, if I was there I would have done the same thing that you did man. No brother, your account is more impressive. I take my account seriously five months ago. Um, what do you mean my account is more impressive? I'm 28 million power and I have 33 million kill points. You are 31 million power which and you have 140 million kill points, man. You just... This is definitely not more impressive. You're definitely doing a lot better than I am. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, it, it's the truth. You're a lot better than I am right now. Oh, it's coming. They are actually going to rally it. They are actually going to rally it. They are actually going to rally this flag. I don't feel like they can, but... Nah, this is going to get swarmed to death. This is going to get swarmed to death. No matter what happens, you just do not have the field presence, so you will just get swarmed to death, man. Yeah, they failed even before they started. But this thing, though, this thing ain't stopping. This flag ain't stopping. This is a huge fight taking place right now. And I don't know what is going on with Blue. Have they woken up yet? Because it appears that they are starting to build, so... It seems like Blue has woken up as well. Okay, maybe not woken up completely, but they s appear to start fortifying their defenses. So at least they're doing something. By building this flag here, they will start being a threat again to the gate. 
meaning that the red guys will need to start coming in here again they gotta put some forces into this because once this flag is built in like three minutes they can just start attacking the gate yet again if, if red isn't like careful about it Tarik Sargon, they shouldn't do Tarik for half for the end this war. I guess right now it, it's kind of like it's a matter of numbers, truth be told. Like if no matter how good the, the the rally is, if you do not have the field presence, you just cannot win it. Like you need people to reinforce the rally anyway. So if they were literally stopped right here, they were stopped right here. So even if the rally was really a good rally. They could reinforce the defense, but these guys cannot reinforce the attack, so... Sadly, there's nothing Sky can do besides just stand there and watch. There's nothing else they can do besides stand there and watch. Why the Attila Garrison? I have no idea why they, why they want to do that. I have literally no idea why they wanted that stuff. <laughs> it's crazy decision making, but hey. New commander, Lapu Lapu. Oh, okay. I'm really curious to see how he does, and he appears to be doing well in here. Like, goddamn. Is Lapu Lapu actually good? Like, some people say it's good, some people say it's bad, so I have no idea what to even think about him. Gorgo Tilly is the best garrison in the game. <sighs> Man, I'm sleepy though. I'm really sleepy. <sighs> I mean, definitely Gorgotila is a nice, nice defense, but it, it's not a good attack though. Okay, they need to reset their marches and everything else. But this this game is actually getting interesting right now. They're starting to burn and everything else, so this thing is getting interesting. This thing is getting hell interesting, and this flag is burning as well. And they're starting to build. Yeah, they're starting to to build some really good defenses to protect both gates and everything else. But I feel like they're just gonna try and defend this gate right now. Also, what happened to this flag? Is it done yet? It's actually done, so are they gonna maybe... Oh, I see that red is actually going for the fight. They probably are gonna rally the flag. Yeah, they are 100% they are gonna rally it. Yo, Aaron, how's it looking, man? Like, are you guys gonna fight or... What do you think is gonna happen? I think Mimi is a popular whale, but from which kingdom? Uh, I heard the name as well, but I've n I have no idea from what kingdom though. I, I'm not really that big into drama or let's just say like gossip, so I know some stuff, but I, I don't exactly know all about it. <laughs> One one seven five, Might be, probably. Okay, so we see that the win is uh, trying to make some trades, but these guys literally just went back to home, even before the fight even started. So, um, okay, yeah, here comes the rally. Here comes the rally. Guys, attack! Why are you not attacking, brother? What exactly are you even waiting for right now? Okay, but Blue is waking up as well. So nice. This, this fight is actually starting to get interesting right now. I want to see what's going on here, though, because this is like the most important moment of the game. One second, sure, man. Yeah, 
another war. Yeah, I see that blue is finally waking up, so let's see how this garrison goes. I mean, it appears as if Hot had this thing covered, but we will see. Like, Wind is a lot closer to their castle, so you can reinforce. You can definitely reinforce it, man. So, why? You should go for that. You should actually reinforce it. You really should start reinforcing that. Don't let that flag burn, man. Do not let that flag burn. You're so close to your home, they're like super far away. It's easier for you to win it. Don't let it die. Just don't let it die. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Nice. Let's go win. There you go, guys. There you go. You finally woke up. Nice. Nice, nice. That, that's basically what, what you should do. Nice resources though, <laughs> nice resources. And look at the troops, like 25 million of each, like god damn. Perfume of Mimi also, like 25 million troops, like this guy is just crazy. Or this woman, whoever she is. <laughs> okay, so nice, you defended the flag, man, Th that's good enough, that's actually really good because now you can just hope that your allies are gonna push against the enemy and if you just hold on everything might just go better for you like this game is, ain't over yet this game is just ain't over yet Nevsky Justinian is gonna destroy it yeah I know but th they were just like closer so even though the, the defense was bad you could just reinforce it you could just have reinforced it but the enemy could not have done the same thing like they only sent like what three guys or everything they sent like three armies in total with that march. Chatwiga? I have no idea what even she is. But I have no idea what this commander is. Probably will never even use her. Probably will never even use her, by the way. Congrats, I, I don't... is she even worth it? You got a two-year-old garrison. <laughs> She's a garrison, yeah, I know, but is she is she a good garrison, though? Is she a good garrison? Like, is, is it worth it for me to... Um, to waste some stuff on her later in the game? Do people even use her? I've never seen her. I've never seen her being used into any defense or whatever, like I've never seen that, that champ being used, like she's like a ghost type of commander right now. So either I have, I don't know about her being so good and it's my fault or she's just terrible. <laughs> Only good for Ark, yeah. I guess I was right after all, she's, she's nothing good. If she's free then she's nothing good, like the, the good commanders are never free. <laughs> The good commanders, you always need the Wheel of Fortune to make it. I think she fell out of the meta, yeah. I would not be surprised, should be told. I would not be surprised. Okay, so Hot is probably gonna prepare like another. Yo, Green Dude, let me know when uh, the next rally is coming, man, because I want to see what's going on in here, like in the bottom. But let me know when the next rally is coming. I want, or maybe like a good trade is happening. Oh, this flag is so close to burning. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait for this to happen. I just cannot wait for this to happen, man. Gotta love getting 2k VIP points from the gold chest. When did that happen? Did I just get 2k gold VIP points? No, I 
nothing like that man I only got like 20 gp points 30 40 50 60 70 80 yeah that's basically what I've got in, in my last couple of days in, in my alliance alliance chest did I, did I get it? did I actually get 2000 points though? like I don't feel like I did Ooh, it's from, oh, it's from the golden chest, never mind. Man, I really cannot wait for this. Like, I have no idea how many of these seeds are gonna burn, but I really cannot wait. <coughs> like, I'm guessing a good amount of these seeds are just gonna burn. Is the most useful point. I hope that I, I get 2000 VIP points, man. It's gonna be amazing. <laughs> it's really gonna be amazing because I definitely need my VIP 14. I'm only getting like two golden sculptures per day, and I have such a long road ahead of me to get my VIP 14. So I definitely gotta, I gotta get that thing done. But I need like at least 250k more gems in order to do that or VIP points okay, let's see what's going on up here okay hot is starting to push again hot is coming forward and if hot is coming forward that means that probably another rally is going to be coming real soon as well Also, aren't you building in here or is it just like this alliance? That's 649 W Warriors. Let's see alliance members. I guess it, it's, it's a normal alliance. Like I've seen nothing, no one in here being like super damn strong. But I just hope that blue wakes up man because it, it's gonna really suck because purple is putting such a such a big war down here that uh, it would suck if purple cannot follow up if, if blue cannot follow up like this flag is already under 1000 man this flag is already one under 1000 like in five minutes everyone is gonna feel the rage of uh, of purple man everyone is gonna feel the rage of purple in like five minutes this thing is, is gonna be huge right now like this thing is just gonna be huge And Sky, it appears that like these guys gave up. In the end, these guys just kind of like gave up. They understood that they just cannot fight PHX right now. They were like, let's let's actually wait for another day. This flag is gone for man. This flag is gone for. Okay, I see that Hot did gather a few numbers in here. They, yeah, they managed to burn it down. They did manage to burn the flag. But if I was the blue, I would just build like a second flag in here, just to make it like harder for them to start pushing. I thought it maybe blue. 
Well, up, but this wasn't the case. Oh man, I'm feeling super sleepy, but I really want to see this uh, this thing happen before I go. I, I'm just so close at this point that I just cannot go to sleep while this happens. I need to at least see the cities that are gonna burn. It's gonna be amazing. You, you know, it's gonna be crazy because once they destroy PH04, they can literally go for the gate as well. So it, it's not like unthinkable for them to do that. They're gonna shut down this alliance anyway. These guys are starting to like teleport out already. Go 500 points more, and this thing is gonna turn huge. Four hundred. Four hundred, like almost done. Almost done. Yep, I'm looking at just that brother. I'm looking just that. I'm telling you I cannot wait for this thing to burn. It's done, yeah, one hundred percent. This is done, man. Like th this thing is gone. You, you just can't stop it anymore. This whole alliance, this whole territory right now is just gonna disappear. And whoever is AFK, whoever is like off offline in here, they're just gonna burn like all of them. You should be there, bro. Yeah, no, nah, I'd rather be here, man. I'm safe and sound, just watching. <laughs> I should not be there. I'm doing my med quest right now. It's okay man, take your time, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Nah, but it's okay Marto. By the way, welcome to the stream man. It's okay brother, like at the end of the day, um, we, we got our own KVK that's gonna be coming into like less than a month. So we gotta prepare for that. We gotta be ready. We gotta be ready for that. No more joking around. Man. We got our own problems. <laughs> And I really hope that we manage to win this KVK, otherwise I'm not gonna... I'm gonna be losing like 3 KVKs in a row, man. I'm gonna be hating that, that, that feeling. Like, we won KVK 1, we lost KVK 2, and then we lost KVK 3. It's, it's starting to get to, to become a pain. It's really starting to be a pain, whenever you think about it. I don't know man, like losing 3 KVKs in a row is really gonna leave a bad taste in my in my mind because you can lose 1 KVK and be fine with it, you can lose 2 KVKs and be fine with it, but if you lose 3 KVKs, uh, 
it, it, it's just it's just not fun anymore like you don't want to just keep losing like because then you start going with the idea of that okay let's just go into the next ABK and let's just lose this one but let's just collect gems it's kind of like <clears throat> that's not what the KVK is all about you should be fighting for it almost yeah almost man it's gone like this thing is gone it's literally 100% gone like, I don't know which guys are gonna get focused just yet but <clears throat> god damn though it's gone like it's just everyone is gonna get burned right now 18 14 10 6 and then boom it's just gone you zoom in you zoom out it's just gone man it's just gone like, I don't know who's gonna become the first or second target but the thing is gone for like, let's just see where the these guys are gonna focus on though Oh, there we go one boom gone for Nika is finished boom line gone for 56 mil oh my gosh like this is such a huge win this is really such a huge win no idea This is just crazy though. Look at them. Look at them. Like this is the, 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 the biggest thing I've ever seen. This guy is gonna eat it as well, man. All of these people, man. All of these people are just getting busted up right now. This is just crazy. This is just crazy. <laughs> this is crazy. Look at them just losing power like this. Oh my god, imagine these people waking up in the morning. Just just imagine them. They're gonna wake up in the morning. And they're gonna be like, what the hell even happened here? <laughs> also, sorry for the message DMs in Rise of Kingdoms. No, no worries, man. Like, you're literally helping me quite a bit. You are helping me quite a bit by doing that. Holy hell, it's not even over. It's not even over. Like, these guys are gonna get demolished. <laughs> They're gonna get swarmed. To the infinity, man. I don't even know how many resources they might they might have but but god damn this guy is shielded let's see anyone else in here who's gonna suffer a bad fate feline also where's the one that uh, speedy no No way. Okay, never mind. He's actually from purple, man. I thought to myself that there was like a 1 out of 10 million guy in here. This guy? This guy is just trying to burn them down. Like, they're like super pissed. Yes, VN. Anyone attack them or. Not yet. They are still coming in here. They're, they're still coming in here. I guess they're just taking up resources at this point. Oh my gosh, I cannot even believe what the party that they're throwing into the last team in chat right now.
Look at this, like this is some huge gain right here, like this is a huge gain. Also this guy, like are they gonna burn him or... So we have one guy in here and we have the SVN guy here as well. It's only these two that I can see who left. Hey, it's okay though, like you literally killed like half the <laughs> the map territory and at the same time you burn two cities down and if you're lucky you're gonna burn like two more if this if both of these guys are AFK. You're gonna burn like two more cities, so you really cannot hope for a better outcome. Yeah, they're really going for this guy. They are just... Oh my gosh. They're just taking all of his resources. They're making sure this guy has nothing to heal on when he gets back. This guy appears to not have had that many resources, but... Not the same thing can be said for... For this dude. Like, I really wonder how many resources he has, man. It, it would take like green dude a lot of time to to actually scout him but i really am curious to know how many resources the guy even has because i'm seeing everyone in his east swarm him. <laughs> holy hell like the whole kingdom is feeding on him the whole kingdom is feeding on him. Look at that, they just keep sending unlimited marches. Everyone is feeding on the guy. Crazy, like, what does this guy even have? <laughs> Bye, bro. I need to prepare and train for my Kingsland tomorrow. Have fun, man. Have fun. If possible, I will try my best to show up and maybe see how your KVK is going too. I'm gonna give him five dollars for the account, give or take. <laughs> All I do in KVK is farm gems. That's the right thing to do. let the whale do this stuff. <laughs> uh, holy hell! So, are you gonna like give him five dollars? Are you gonna take five dollars from him? <laughs> That's the big question. Also, aren't these guys gonna get like focused or... Nobody seems to be looking at these two cities so I don't, I don't get it. Are these guys like burned down or something? They're not exactly going for this guy right now. It's kind of weird. Scout coming in one minute. Okay, nice. Also need to see what's going on with this guy. Like, he's, he's starting to get scouted, but is he going to get attacked or... get scouted question is is he online or is he offline he's still getting he's still oh, okay <coughs> this guy is still getting attacked though like what the hell 
what does this guy even have like can you imagine like he must have lost like billions of resources so far he must have lost like billions of resources so far man getting rally this guy's getting rally too his guy's getting rally too man well he has nothing left anymore it appears that he's plundered but I'm pretty sure that he has a lot of stuff if he was getting uh, if he was getting attacked so much but this guy's gonna get rally though watch him go 59 mil into what what is this guy gonna become what is this guy gonna become right now? Thankfully, I have come come his resource before being zeroed. Okay. Yo, and why is she as a garrison? Like, god damn, brother, five million power just gone, just donezo. He's being donezo, man. Holy hell! Like this, this thing was definitely worth the wait. This thing was definitely worth the wait, man. Like, I just cannot believe. I just can't even imagine being these guys. I really can't even imagine being these guys right now. Like how crazy is that? And these guys are starting to like build because 100% they will just keep going. I don't I don't feel like they're just going to be No resources to be plundered here. He only has tier fours, like barely any tier fives left. But thank you for the scouts, Queen Dude. I appreciate it. I really do appreciate the scouts, man. They help a lot. Okay, guys. With that being said, though, I really feel like I need to get my ass to sleep because it's like 2 a.m. my time. So I appreciate. All of you stopping by my stream, I really do, and I feel like it's time to call it a day. To call it like a day, man. Maybe I'll do like another live stream tomorrow, but for the night, I feel like this is more than more than enough because uh, hey, it's three hours and a half, man. I know it doesn't look much, but it's definitely tiring for me. So I'll see you guys in the next KVK. Love you all. Like and subscribe if you love if you love the content. EOA is up now. Oh man, are they? Okay, I get <sighs> Fine. The peace? Nah, come on. Let, let, let's just see IOA. Where, where are you online? Like, are, are you starting to fight anywhere? Or? It, it, it's bad that your guys are online right now. I ain't gonna lie, man. Like, this thing is really feels bad. Where's IOA, by the way? Where is your your territory? Oh yeah man. I'm really sorry that I really 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 cannot stay with you man and see what IOA is gonna pull uh, but maybe if I wake up in the morning and I got some time I can maybe like make like another stream but for now I'm really tired and I need to get my ass to sleep so I was I woke up today at like 6 a.m. I've been at work I haven't slept at all. I'm literally basically 22 hours without sleep right now. And uh, before I get my ass to sleep deprived, I feel like uh, <laughs> I feel like it's kind of time for me to. Uh, yeah, I really do feel like it's time for me to just get my ass to sleep, and I'm sorry. I'm too tired right now to to keep watching this, but 
maybe I, we can look at this like another day like hopefully if you guys keep fighting good enough I can, I can see this kvk going on another time so thank you all 99 thank you for staying with me all all the way to the end man i appreciate it also green dude and everyone else i'll see you guys in the next one peace out from april